Hello. Hi, everyone. Wow, look at all those people in chat. Good to see you all here. Hi. Hello. Welcome to all of our wonderful subscribers, our members. And if you're not yet either of those, make sure you click or tap that subscribe button because we're going to be playing this game a few times this week, I think. Welcome, everybody, to This Land is My Land, an open-world survivor exploration, maybe building game? I'm actually not sure what to expect in this game, so I guess we're all in for a real treat today. Hi there. What's up, Austin? I'm Cole. Good to see everyone here. Hi. Hello. How are all of you? Very good. What's up, Crema? King Boo? Recon? Good to see everybody here. We had, uh, I think, like maybe five or six more people who uh, joined and became members today. So that's awesome. Thank you, everybody, for all of your support. And uh, shout out to all those people who became some wonderful members. Cool. Well, I gave this game about a five-minute try. This is My Land is the name of the game. And um, I haven't really seen much of it at all. So I guess we'll uh, see what we have in store. I just wanted to make sure it worked, and it does, so I guess we're in for a real treat. Uh, let's see. So the game, I think, is also in early access, too, so we'll see exactly what it has to, uh, to offer very soon. Uh, thanks for smashing that like button, too. Thank you, all of you guys. Smash and like. That's very nice of you all. Appreciate it. Very cool. Thank you. And uh, I guess we should start our resistance. Apparently, this is also like an online multiplayer game too I see there's like an offline mode active I'm just gonna keep that on for now so uh, let's get into it then uh, Rosen and Ka, hi there hello good to see you just five minutes yeah I've only seen the intro so I haven't even done anything like that so we'll see yeah let's learn together I completely agree but first this epic music's got to come to an end before we get stuck this is good this is too good music to skip I like this <laughs> hi there nautical luck how are you Fantastic. Good to see you here. You are awesome. Welcome aboard. Bum, 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 bum. Hi there, Leah. Good to see you as well. There's online trade and chat. Okay. Well, that that's kind of cool. I like that. Okay. Well, uh, we're going to get started, and I guess I don't know exactly what to, ex uh, to experience, so I guess we'll just see. Uh, I'll start a new... Actually, I'm going to delete this one because I just tried it for like five minutes. So let's start a new resistance, and let's load. Some enemies appeared in your world because of social. Uh, okay. <laughs> there should be a little bit more explanation about that. Hi there, Manol Ivanov. Good to see you here. Welcome to all the new, new subscribers subscriber popping up on the out. screen, by the way. You guys are awesome. Thank you very much for all the love. And uh, we're almost to 15 new members today. We're trying to unlock new some more emotes. So everyone who clicks or taps join and becomes even a low-tier member. That's top-tier support, baby. So thank you very much. New subscriber shout out. Yeah, welcome to all of you. You guys are great. Uh, I got in here while I was looking for an opportunity to join a great warrior named. Uh, your name is your lineage and will bring you great power or great demise. Let's go with the Raptor. Plus 200 SP, plus 15 stamina. Cool. Is camp located? Uh, well, let's do a normal start. Quite far from the frontier, he prefers to grow his strength before entering open warfare. Okay. No, oh, I hear horses. Okay, apparently we got bailed out. Resistance of Raptor began. Okay. Brave warriors are now heading towards a recently sent camp. So I guess our, like, our other brothers rescued us from a train that we were held captive on, and now we're going to a camp somewhere nearby. Interesting. Hi there, Dama. How you doing? You got a job interview tomorrow at the theme park business? Awesome, Blaze. I also own uh, Planet Coaster. Recently rescued warriors told me that the person responsible for massacres which led to the almost complete annihilation of my people are staying in a camp nearby. I'll find them and make them pay for all the pain and suffering they cause. This land will be mine. And we shall call it Raptoria. Techno Pirate has become a member of Raptoria. Thank you for joining my, my tribe by clicking and tapping that join button. Thank you very much. 
Let's get him. Uh, let's get him this, the the food of our people, the uh, wonderful hot pocket. Yes, the traditional food of our people. Increasing power. Convince uh, Neshkamis leader to join your fight. Oh, that's like another local tribe. Wow, do we look awesome? That is awesome. Oh, dude. All right, that that is that is cool. Glory to Raptoria. Wonder if we, okay, so we can find horses and stuff, and looks like these guys are cleaning animals and making uh, skin and stuff out of them. Basic controls. Uh, roll, change stance, sneak, and switch camera. Okay. Convince Neshkim. Okay, so we got to go find that leader. So he would be that away, I guess. All right. Bye, everyone. Love you. I don't know who you are, but all right. Uh oh, we have a river to cross. Oh, this is going to be great. Uh oh. We better find a way to cross up river. Looks like it's already dark. You guys know it's not a raptor stream unless it's almost midnight all the time. So that's good. <laughs> all right. Welcome to all the new subs. You guys are great. And let's get some hot pockets in chat, boys. We got ourselves a new member. Hold E to access skills. Some can be used while holding G. We can smoke herbs. Uh, we can lure the enemy. Or we can throw some stone. Or possibly shade if we have access to Twitter. Okay. Well, I guess we're just going to first go to that... Oh, wow, we have shoes. Awesome. Or, the... or as they were called, moccasins. New subscriber shout -out. All right, let's just try to cross here, I guess. Whoa, that jump. I don't know if we can get swept down river. I'm having, like, flashbacks to Death Stranding. There we go. Oh, that was sweet. Okay, cool. All right, well, let's go chat with the other guy. Uh, press Q to change the camera. Yep, got that. Yeah, this dude does some awesome jumps. This 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 guy would be great on Black Friday. Like, oh, Nintendo Switch for $2? Perfect, got it. Got to go to the checkout now. <laughs> All right, let's see. We'll head over uh, this way now that we've crossed the river. Oh, is there stuff I can pick? I wonder if there's an Arby's around here, like a shopping mall. If we need anything, we can just swing by a hardware store. That'd be fine. Do 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 do. Pick your nose? Well, you can pick your nose, but you can't pick your friend's nose. Oh, oh dear. You see why I wear the sunglasses now? It's it's very bright out at nighttime. The, the moon is very bright. Oh, it's a full moon. Whoa, he was climbing that tree. Actually, very nice. So I'm assuming we can get horses and stuff. This is very the very beginning of the game, so like all the stuff we should be getting, like you know, weapons and stuff will probably come in a little bit of time. But right now, we will just make our way towards the uh, other friendly camp. I feel like I should have maybe investigated some stuff before we left, but I tried the game earlier and there really wasn't anything at the camp. I don't know if that changes or not, but we can always go back there. I wonder if there's a map. Do-do-do. What's up, Aiden? Hi there. How are you? Brown mushroom. Ah, we can pick stuff. Yeah, let's grab that. Oh, po po potions. We're not we're not making like uh, we're not eating. We're making potions and traps. I wonder if I can be a wizard class Native American. That'd be cool. Native Americans had wizard class. I think they had a tank class. Uh, rogue, thief, mage. <laughs> they were very well known for their paladins as well. You'll need to gather all the hickory and everything you can get your hands on. Okay. Now, for those of you guys watching my first time, the less you don't tell me, the funnier it'll be when I get attacked by a bear. Just keep that in mind. The more you don't tell me, the funnier it'll be. We're going to go chat with these locals, I guess. Also, pressing tab. Brown mushroom, flax, and wood. Oh, here's the map here. Oh, ooh, whoa. Wow, this map's huge. Whoa, that is huge. That is really a huge map. That's crazy. We've only walked that far from camp. Oh, there's a... Oh, that's a wolf. Uh-oh. Okay, we want to be very careful about going near that wolf. Okay. Well, I started with 200 SP. I don't even know what SP is, but... Ooh, what was that? Black what? Black... 
Kohosh? Kohosh root. Okay, so there's probably stuff that's used for healing, stuff that's used for trading. Okay, I guess I should, like, start gathering stuff, but... First quest is to just get across the map. We gotta go, like, another kilometer. Is that an animal? What is that? Is that a down tree? Oh, more of this stuff. Do 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 do. Red dot mushrooms, nice. Wow, we're doing all our grocery shopping. You guys need anything while I'm out? Anybody need like uh, I can swing by the uh, the post office if you guys need me to drop anything off. Cool. Uh, let's grab these. I don't know what's going to be useful or not, so I guess we'll just grab everything, and then when I realize that it's worth nothing, then we can all laugh. Except I know flax is pretty, pretty important for making fibers. You think we're going to make bourbon coffee? Oh yeah, well, this is the Wild West, so I mean, we could trade for bourbon. Firewater. That'd be kind of cool. New subscriber shout-out. Harley, thanks for subbing. Welcome aboard. Thanks to all of you guys joining my, uh, my, my tribe, my clan tonight. Appreciate that. And welcome to all the new members this, uh, week as well. Okay. Well, flax seems to be quite plentiful, so I don't know... I don't know if it's, like, super important, but I guess we'll just keep grabbing it. This is a beautiful world, though. This is really on par with, like... I mean, it's not... It's not, like, at the level of Red Dead, but it's, like... It's pretty close. It just doesn't have, like, all the, the lighting effects and stuff just yet. But this is pretty cool. What is this stuff? Fireweed. Okay. You can make rope with flax, yeah. I thought I, I thought I heard something rust, rustling around. Oh, up! Ah! Trow, troust. Stop that. <laughs> oh, we're gonna get we're gonna get tackled by a bear, boys. All right. So any flax I find, I'll try to get if it's like not too far out of the way. Then I want to try to find apparently hickory. What is going on with my leg? Okay, we have a broken leg now. Yes, the, uh, yes. That is a glitch. <laughs> oh, wait, I, did I press, I think I pressed G to put landing gear up. What's the landing gear button? Oh, oh crap. Now I've angered a wolf. Uh-oh. There's an outpost nearby. You can initiate fast travel from nearest outpost with a lit campfire to an outpost. Oh, great. Now I have to run from a wolf with one leg. This is... This is great. I am, uh... My new name is uh, Hops on One Foot. Great. Runs from wolves on one foot. A okay, tab. Where are we at? Okay, there's an outpost. What? What is that? Erling Games Woods Camp. Well, let's go to this outpost first. The wolf is scared of my leg? How do you think I feel? It's literally... <laughs> look at the foot move. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> well, there's definitely a wolf around here somewhere. wonder if it can hear me. Do I have a weapon? Let me check my inventory. Craft. Oh, macaroni and cheese? Oh, here we go. Craft a wooden bow. There we go. And then arrow. Okay. Let's see if I can pull out the weapon. Press 1 to switch to the weapon. Okay. Low quality. Oh, look, guys. It's just like the streams. Okay, now we're, we're ready to pop a fool. And where's the camp? Should be over here. Ooh, hickory. I have my, I have my landing gear, pulled up. <laughs> my leg is broke. I didn't, I didn't do anything. I just walked over a hill and it kind of just like tucked up into my backside. Please note that you can save the game at certain points on friendly campfires or uh, campfire in the outpost. Exiting the game without save might re uh, result in losing progress. Okay. Well, let's get this 
Can we get some fires in chat, guys? Can we get some flames in chat? I, I need some help. Oh, there we go. Well, let, let's rest and save. Should I try to reload this? <laughs> Chris, thanks for subbing. The leg problem happens a lot. Oh, I see. I'll need to get myself a wheelchair. Name of the game. Uh, all you got to do is just read the title. That's all you got to do. All the information you need is up there. Wow, look at this. That is some, that's some Olympic level. Wow, look at that. That's intimidating. Like, if anyone walks up to me, they know I can do, really do some Taekwondo. Look at that. Wow, and I can shoot behind me? That, that's talent. That is talent. Oh, now it's daytime. Yay! All right, cool. Now we can see again. That's good. Uh, all right, so we got to make our way through Wolf Valley and make our way towards the neutral camp. All right. Oh, just an 8.5 on form? Oh. It's going to grab everything. I don't even know if there's like a weight limit or whatnot. Oh, here's Hickory again. All right, Hickory's easy to find. It's just these little trees. Now, again, this is an early access game, so lol on the leg, but, I mean, you know, it's not the end of the world. It just looks funny, that's all. Can you go prone? I don't think so. I can crouch and, like, sneak, but that's about it. I'm the best? I mean, I'm the best of the worst, yeah. Or the worst of the best. I don't know. Okay. Uh, let's grab some more of, what is this? Flax? Yeah. I'll just keep grabbing. Actually, can I make more arrows? I feel like I'm going to need more than five. The first five are probably going to miss from me learning the, uh... Yeah, my, my Native American name is uh, No Leg, No Leg. Very, uh, very ancient name from, from my people. Oh dear, look, there's a there's a deer. Oh, he is running. I don't know if we need meat though. I I don't even know if I can like skin him or I'd hate to shoot it and not be able to use it. So I will just hold off until I know how to do that. This land is my leg. <laughs> yeah. Uh this game is called This Leg is My Leg. I know it looks like I stole it from somebody else, but uh Okay, so we just got to keep going this way? Okay. Want to make sure I'm on the right foot. And you know, we got to put our best foot forward. So we got to go about 600 meters. How far is that? Is that like a leg and a foot? How much does this game cost? Uh, about an arm and, uh, and a leg. <laughs> if you want on sub now, now, now it's really the only chance. Okay, let's see. There's another camp there. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Actually, that leg is providing uh, forward thrust, you know, like from the wind. Oh, it's all good. Yeah, maybe we can make Hot Pockets in the game. All we need is some pepperoni cheese and... Uh, and there's another outpost there and then there's a... Uh oh, there's a camp there. I don't know who I don't know who those camps are though. Is that uh like bandits or something or people we can raid? Dylan with the two says hey, hey Dylan. How are you? Guys, let's just not worry about the leg, okay? Let's just put our best foot forward and you know, try to get a leg up on knocking out some of these goals. New subscriber shout out. You know, we don't have to knee the game in the groin. Oh my, that that jump though. Look, look at this. Damn, look at that. Wow, this is fast travel right here. Wow, that's that's awesome. Alright, let's not go over there. Let's try to climb up this way. Just like this leg, let's just put it all behind us, guys. I totally want to wrestle a bear though or something. Yeah, there's a bandit camp over there, but I'm trying to go this way. To the Nesh Neshkemis camp. Nes Neskenmis? Uh, 
All right, let's see. Yeah, the more you guys don't tell me, the the, the better the gameplay will be. So if you, if you let me figure things out on my own and make mistakes, it'll be funnier. A lot of people like to say, painful to watch, frustrating to watch, but it, it's funny. Like, when you watch somebody, like, if you gave your grandma Minecraft to play for the first time, and you watch your grandma for 45 minutes trying to get, uh, you know, like, knock down a tree, that's funny. Now there's animals, but I don't, I don't want to shoot them just yet. Well, at least one of our shoes is going to be really worn out, and the other one's going to be, uh... Oh, it's so cool to see wild animals. I definitely want to, like, hunt them. Okay, we're very close to the camp now. And what is that? That is a... That is a horse, of course. Is that... Is that the camp itself? Oh, maybe we can buy a horse. Awesome. Okay, now maybe we can... Okay, if the horse's legs get screwed up, that's going to be awesome. Wow, cool. Oh, and there's hickory here, too. Let's grab some of that. Hello, sir. How do I talk to you? Yes, I am Raptor. Uh, will your camp join our fight? We will join as soon as you have three camps. Can you be one camp? We will join as soon as you have three camps. What does that mean? Three... New subscriber shout out. What does that mean? Spartan, thank you for subbing. Three camp. Oh my... Oh, there's a fort there. Uh-oh. Oh, this would be really cool. Multiplayer fort raiding. That would be awesome. Hmm. Okay. Can I borrow a horse? Oh! Cool. We gotta name the horse, though. The next person to click or tap the join button. Next person to join, we're gonna name the horse after. We gotta, we gotta name our horsey. Next member. Ooh, look at that. Gold. We got the gold and the red paint, or... I think they might, both might be the same. Oh, this one looks... Actually, a little cooler. Let's. I think we should go with this one. Oh, did that fix our leg? Let's see. Yay, our leg's fixed. Sweet, now we have horses. That's awesome. That's totally fine that we can... That's awesome that we can have a horse now. Do I have to light these little outposts? He said camps, though. So, oh, do we have to find a third camp? So there's one, there are two. So we'd have, we have to find a third one, then. Maybe. Okay. Let's go find a third camp. Oh, cool. We can just kind of like... We can kind of just trot along. Very nice. Well, thanks for all the likes, guys. Thank you, everybody, for subscribing. You're all awesome. Thanks for joining me today for this game. I'm having fun so far. Just kind of exploring a little bit. Pretty cool, I'd say. All right, let's go find another camp. Is there a way I can... Can I talk to the other guy? Or trade with them? I better check that before we leave, but... I'm kind of getting the hang of the horse here. Oh, okay, we can have him run, too. All right, let's go... Do uh, we can chat with the other guy or possibly buy something? Where'd the other guy go? Is he sleeping? There's just two guys at this camp. Oh, well. I'll just wander around. That's the best way to explore in an open world game. Yeah, subscribing? Yeah, if you, if you subscribe, your name will pop up on the screen, and that's how you can get a shout-out if you're looking for one. The horse fixes everything? That's good. I don't know why he's got such a long face, but... Cliff jumps are the best? Alright, let's try to go over to Cliff. Oh, that didn't really do much. Oh, we got some hickory there. Oh, we have to get off to grab that stuff? It'd be cool if we could do it on the horse. Right now, all I have is a bow and arrow, so that's kind of cool. At least that I get a weapon without having to put too much effort into it. That's nice. Like, instead of having to find, like, bone and sinew and all this other stuff. 
But maybe the arrows can be upgraded to have like um Maybe the arrows can be upgraded to have like bone tips or maybe Remember, maybe we can get a gun. <gasps> oh oh Belisi Belsi Bub Aw, let's call our horse Bell. It, it's a girly horse. Thank you very much for clicking the tab of that join button. Our horse is now Bell. Can you shoot while on horseback? We sure can. Although I don't know what we're going to shoot yet. Might have to have a camp to sit down for a while. Although I'm going to take it slow until we find something of importance. New subscriber shout -out. Never mind. Let's go. <laughs> okay, we found Detroit. Let's go around the city. What was that? Here, you wait here, girl. New subscriber shout out. What was that? Oh, we must be close to that camp. There's a wild boar up here. Oh, I don't want to go near that fort. All right, roads are bad news. They all lead to, uh... Come on, Bell. Yeah, let's go. So all roads lead to forts, so that's not good. I guess we're going to have to take the off-road path. Let me take a look at the map. Let's go to... Uh... I guess we'll just head north and see what's up there. I wonder if the... Oh, I see a little rabbit over there. I wonder if the, the boar... Yep, the boars will attack us, wild boar. Woo! Got ourselves a piggy, boys. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Got him! Solid, thank you very much. All, lead, all roads lead to Rome, he says. Thank you very much for the $1. We got him, boys! One shot, one kill. All right. Uh, increasing power. Convince... Yeah, I need to get three camps, though. Dead boar. Oh, I got two meat and one sinew from it. Perfect. All right, now we have lunch. Got them, boys. Mm. Okay, so they will they run like crazy, and they will attack you. So that Oh, it's not just one boar. Maybe it's a whole family of boar. Speaking of boar, if you guys want to click or tap that join button, there's a whole world of boar waiting for you as a new subscriber. Many mediocre at best videos. That was an actual first try. Actually, that was our that was our that was zero tries. That wasn't even trying. Uh, the horse's name is Bell now. Bell became a new member. So, all right, let's take it slow. I don't want to run into any more surprises. And then if we happen to find a camp, we'll take a little rest. Okay, so far this is really cool. And, like, we're not even doing anything. We're just kind of, like, exploring. And that's really fun. Hi there, Harry. Do we have to reload our mag? Or our, our bow and arrow? And can I put any quick scopes or anything on this? Or a bipod or whatever? Dude, this looks so cool. This is so cool. Yeah, that's a handprint on the, the horse's behind. And there's some other like painting and stuff with like clay or berries or something. I don't I don't know exactly what it's for, but that's really cool. Mag. Oh, I'm sorry. I meant clips. Do you have to reload the clip for the the bow and arrow? Actually, I can get skills, can't I? How did I get skills again? New skills. Oh wow, there's pistol ac. Oh, we can get guns, boys. There's pistol accuracy. Oh my god. Bow accuracy plus one. Uh, we're no near have. Oh, I can be a chief. Or a hunter. Oh, I'm... Okay. Skill points. So I think we have to spend those. Right now I have 669, so we need to get a little bit higher. How do I get skills? Killing animals and stuff, or what? Oh, yeah, we get our Gatling bow. Eventually we'll upgrade to that. That'll be cool. Okay, I'm going to stop and gather some hickory then while we're here. Now, now. Don't you fret. You just stay right there. Wow. It's a good spot to find Hickory. I am the chief? 
Uh, no, I think I think you're confusing me with Chief Boyardi, the guy who makes the raviolis. That that's my that's my favorite. He's the best chief. And then there's also Kansas City. They got a, quite a few. No, those are chefs. I'm sorry. Those guys are actual cooks. Okay. So if I craft more stuff, I also get SP? Okay, that's cool. Well, I certainly could use a few more bow and arrow then. Just in case. Oh. Oh, we can use... I wonder if I can put the mushrooms on uh, arrows and stuff like that. Horse, what's wrong with you? You have a cold? Are you gonna sneeze? What's going on? What the? F what was that noise? Is that a bear? Oh, ooh, there's a little outpost up there. Okay, which way are we going? Oh, we're heading the right, right direction. Can you build camps anywhere? No, it seems like the I can only go to the fast travel camps by finding them. And then I need to I think I need to find another group of like Native Americans to build like one big camp. I'm not sure exactly what's going on right now, but I don't care. Like I just one shot at a boar and I'm buying a bunch of like I'm finding a bunch of stuff. What's going on? This looks really suspicious. There better not be a ninja or something jumping out. Better go left. Yeah, I don't want to go over that way. Should I sneak up on the camp at nighttime? Oh! It's a boar. It's a boar. No, thank you. Is he going to chase me still? Oh, he's still coming. Wow, that... I hope he gets in... Attacked by a wolf. Oh, great. Now I got a coyote and a, and a boar after me. How great. Sir, stand down. Okay. I gave him a warning. Sir? Okay. Oh, you're not dead. Oh, he hauled ass. All right. Well, I, did, I certainly didn't want to shoot the dog. That was a warning shot. Okay, I think the coyote just wandered into the human's camp or something. <laughs> what was that, man bear pig? Yeah, the camp is over here. Where exactly is it? Can I mark on the map? I don't think I can make marks on the map. Oh, I can. I'm hearing noises, but I don't see stuff. That makes me very scared. are these noises? It sounds like an animal drinking water? Okay. Anyway, um, where was that camp? I just saw it. To the left? Oh, over there. Okay. Nighttime is like freaking me out. <laughs> uh, a bear? I, I don't know. I don't know what we're going to encounter here. Let's, uh. Okay, standing in the fire is probably a bad idea. Can I. How do I sleep? Dangerous animals too close. Alright, sorry, horse. Time to be put down. Or maybe a different animal. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, uh, can you build on the camps? I don't know. I need to apparently find another camp in order to... Uh, I gotta find another camp in order to, like, unite the camps. So I guess I just gotta wander around until I find other friendly Native Americans, I guess. Which, there's one right there. Okay. 
We're good. Uh, let me set a waypoint to that camp. And we will go say hello. Blueberries? Yeah, I don't know if... When, when do I have to eat and stuff? Is there like a tracker for that? Health is good. Stamina is good. Weight... I don't know. It's all good. We'll just kind of wander around. Do I know you? I, I do not know you. But, uh, welcome, regardless. New subscriber shout -out. Welcome to Silent Wolf 1. Thank you very much for clicking and tapping that uh, subscribe button. Appreciate that. And welcome to our new members. People smash new and join. Very nice you all. Out. Oh, there's no the food system isn't implemented yet? Oh, good. Then I can wander around a little bit. Do I weigh 40 pounds? I don't know if that 40 means kilograms or pounds. I think that's probably kilogram... Maybe. It's probably pounds. I don't know. I got 15 XP for killing a boar. Oh, yeah. Let's see where we're at now. We're at 684, so we got to go a little bit further. What is going on? Oh, it's a coyote again. Where's that friendly camp? Over here? I wonder if I get close to a camp if it'll... um. I can't see my reticle. Hey, leave the horse alone. Yeah, this aiming system is a little weird when it gets close. Well, there's two coyotes. All right, time to run. Andre, thanks for subbing. Yeah, I guess maybe I can only carry so much weight because I, I don't really have much for, like, storage. Like, I don't really have, like, a backpack or anything like that. It's just, like, a little saddlebag or something. Hi, guys. Can you help me out? I've angered some uh, coyotes. New subscriber shout -out. Never mind. Hoffman, thanks for subbing. Oh, we can trade. We can upgrade a horse. Cool. All right, you stay here. I'll put the parking brake on so we can't move. All right. Oh! This must be a college campus. Let's see. Um, let's go talk to this guy over here. Raptor. Yes, that's me. Will you join our camp? Uh, as soon as you have three camps. What? You're my third camp. I don't. I don't know what to do. Well, oh, what was that guy gonna do? Was that two? Was that two loaves of bread, sir? What were you gonna do there? Okay. Well, now I don't know what to do. Because I've discovered camp number one can join your resistance. Camp number two and camp number three. Does does the first one not count, maybe? Oh, I can actually tra fast travel there. Upgrade. Send warriors to a different... Oh, that's cool. So we can actually get like all of our camps together to like start a resistance. That's kind of neat. Hmm. And it looks like the camp stay discovered, too, on the map, so I just gotta, like, fast travel back here later or something? Can I trade with these guys? Oh, here we go. Loot. New you can't steal from neutral or friendly camps. Oh, I wasn't trying to, like, steal. I wanted to trade. One doesn't count, so I need to find one more? Okay. Click the settle icon on the panel. Uh... You mean on the original camp? Set up new camp. New camps will allow you to claim regions if no enemies are left near. Oh! So I can set up small camps around my main camp? Are you sure you want to settle? Okay. Zero one warrior has weapons. Oh, I have three warriors. Okay. So then I can have these people join our camp. So we'll send we'll send one warrior. But he doesn't have weapons. Uh, I guess take a horse. Zero out of one warrior has weapons. I don't understand. 
Uh, please hover over the items and give to warriors button. New subscriber shout out. I don't know where that is. Victoria, thanks for seven. Appreciate that. Do do do. Uh, equip group. That's not working. Let me try that again. So apparently I need to set up small camps around our main camp. And then these other camps that I found, they'll join our big camp. So that's kind of cool. So let's go... Alright, let's try this again. So, settle. A new camp. Let's just go close. You want to settle? Yes. Uh, let's see. Give to warriors button to give specific items. Left alt or left ship while clicking to give a... Hmm. Uh, send warriors to gather resources. Maybe I can make it that way? But they don't have weapons. Oh, maybe I can tell them to... Oh, let's... Okay, if they need to make weapons, then let's have one gather flax. And then let's have another gather... Wood. And let's have another one do wood, I guess. Gather wood. Okay, so in a little bit we should have enough supplies to make weapons then. And then make three more. And then, am I able... To, I guess I'm able to recruit from these other camps. So we got like three dudes here who will probably join us. And then I can get the other guys and then we can like uh, keep gathering. Uh, what year does this t take place? Oh, it's a re I mean, obviously it's a real long time ago. So at least like 2005 or six. You can tell because like nobody has iPhones or anything yet. And there's no and there's no Wi-Fi, so it's got to be like the 90s at least, <laughs> somewhere between the 90s and the early 2000s. All right, well I guess we hang out then until our camp has made enough stuff. Let's see. Oh, there you go. You can actually see them out gathering stuff, dude. Cool. So, this is like Army Building Simulator. So, like, I can go out to these other camps and recruit these dudes when we have three camps and then uh, gather them all together to make more supplies. So, our, our army is going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. What's up, 1v Timmy? How you doing, bro? What's up? Okay, well, while we're waiting for them to gather stuff, let's, like, I guess go out and hunt or something or gather more stuff ourselves. Can I make weapons for them? Maybe I can bring back a ton of stuff myself. Go gather some wood and flax and bring it back. Gather some wep weapons and ammo. Damn, this is beautiful. It's very lush. Very lush. Uh, solid with one could be 1969 like Woodstock visitors. Yeah, we're 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 preparing for Woodstock. That's what this is all about. <laughs> all right, now I wonder if I can fast travel to that other camp to recruit them when we have enough camps. Let's see. Do I need to go back to this camp as soon as we build three camps? I like how we can like call back to like, hey, what's up? What are you guys doing? <laughs> now just hanging out. Yeah, could you guys gather some uh, wood and stuff so we can make bow and arrows? Yeah, okay, bye. I love you, too. Suggestion for new gaming channel. Love from India. New gaming channel? I can't even get this one working right. Okay, have they, how do I check inventory on this stuff? Uh, oh, orders. Oh, can I order, like, a... Wow, that is a great band name, ladies and gentlemen. Brown Mushroom Infusion. That is definitely a 60s band, if I've ever heard it. That is awesome. There we go. We can make wooden arrows and wooden bows. So let's make three of those. I don't know. Let's make ten. Let's make ten of these. And then let's add an order of... What do you guys want, by the way? You guys want a medium two topping? or Nah, we should probably do a large. We got we got quite a few people in here. Can we get some dominoes in chat? Can we, can we get a bunch of dominoes emotes? 
from all of our lovely members. We def we're we're going to need a lot. Yeah, we'll put some. Uh, what do you guys want on it? You guys want some brown mushrooms, uh, some boar, and then should we do thin crust? Is everyone cool with thin crust? Because some of that crust can be really doughy. I know some of you guys like deep dish, and that y you're crazy. But I think we should at least do a thin crust. It turns out better. Meat lovers? Well, we're going to go have to find a bear then. Let's do ten, ten rounds each. There we go. <laughs> All right, now we need our boys to go out and do their, their thing. Wow, oh, days pass by quick in this game. Medium crust? No. No, thin crust. All right, meat. Okay. A regular. Okay, we can settle for a regular crust. You want sinew on yours? Okay. All right, we're, we're not doing the, the crazy vegan options, okay? We'll just do the meat lovers and we'll call it a day. You want some hickory smoked? Well, let me grab some hickory then while we're here. There we go. What if we can make jerky in this game? That'd be cool. Oh, a bear stuffed crust? Well, that sounds really gross. Good suggestion. <laughs> Alright, I guess we have to make our way back to the other camp to recruit them, so let's just uh, make sure we avoid that fort, fort death before we go over there. So let's go this way. Get some breadsticks as well. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, let, let's get a two-liter... Uh, what do you guys want? Pepsi? Two-liter Pepsi? Is that enough for 400-something people? Okay, we're going to need a lot of pizza. I think I'm going to place an order for, like, uh, 25 large pizzas. Uh, probably about another 20 liters of, of soda. And then... Uh, you guys want the cine sticks though? Can we do cine sticks? Cheese Breadsticks are kind of like... If I want breadsticks, I'll go to Olive Garden. I think we should just do the cine sticks with the... Uh, uh, the, the, what is it, the icing, the icing dip. You want Mountain Dew? All right, fine, we'll, all right, we'll do half Mountain Dew and half, uh, Pepsi. That, that'll turn out just fine. Or we can do Hot Pockets, but that's going to be a lot of, that's going to be a lot of microwaves. You want your own two liter? Well, we're ordering 20. I'm sure some people might just want water. You know, it's New Year's, some people might be watching their, their diet a little bit for the New Year. Deep fried Mars bars. Whoa. Crazy, bro. What is that? Is that a bunny? As long as we don't encounter a boar. Those things are dangerous. Oh, okay. We gotta put it in four wheel drive. There we go. What was that? Oh, great. We're heading towards boring territory again. Yeah, heavy breathing. I think that was just somebody in chat who was just expecting that pizza pretty soon. I'll check the pizza tracker, guys. It'll it'll be here in five days. It takes them a while to make. I think it's the type of order where you got to call like two days ahead of time just so they're ready. They can call in an extra employee to like just work on that order all day. I think... Um, Oh, bacon pizza is good. I, I think I like myself just like some sausage, some onion, and uh, mushroom. I, I like the the savory flavors. My my palate as an adult has changed. You know, it's not like when you're a kid you just want the purple ketchup and uh, just some tater tots. Entering Fort Mojave. Uh oh. Hold on a second. Let's get another topping here. Whoa! Oh, we took a hit. Wasn't a headshot. Oh, this is a crazy one. <laughs> Got him. All right, let's get some bacon and mushroom for our pizza. Let's see here. Okay, there's the bacon, and where's the mushrooms? There they are. Oh, let's put some death caps on that too. That sounds good. Ooh, some hickory. Some hickory smoked bacon. And some death caps. There we go. Uh, Horace, where'd you go? There you are. New subscriber shout out. Christopher, thanks for subbing. Welcome aboard. And welcome to all of our new members today. I need some more uh, members in my army, new by the way. So if you haven't yet become a member, now's the time to click or tap that join. I need some more recruits. New subscriber shout out. 
Oh, a train is going to be coming in an update? Oh, that sounds really cool. Can we, like, rob the train? This is kind of like a first look. I feel like I should have waited a little bit on this game because there's a lot of promising things coming, but it's kind of just fun to walk around and, like, explore a new world, isn't it? Especially when that world is, like, the beautiful American West. Oh, just gorgeous. You can name your camps, too. Okay, I'm going to name my first camp, uh, Camp Eat Your Shorts, or Salute Your Shorts, sorry. Uh, what are we invading? Uh, the pantry pretty soon. Okay, so the camp we got to go to is up here. How's our main camp doing? Actually, I better get out of here before the boars come and attack me. Oh, here's the road. Seems like a country road. Uh, it's going to be on our right. Oh, it's there up on the thing. Patrick Forrest Boivik vanished? Oh, what? We can expand our borders and stuff and, like, battle it out? Sweet. Yeah, let's go this way. Yeah, the spear update's coming soon. That'll be kind of cool for, like, quick takedowns of stuff without having to have a bow and arrow. Okay, so now... It's just going to be to our right. Uh-oh, it's up there. I think I need to go this way. New subscriber shout-out. Logan, thanks for subbing. Welcome aboard. Fort Earminister. Okay. Is that a prime minister? All right, I think we. All right, hold on. I gotta put the. Okay, we gotta put differential lock on to get up here. Oh, it's gonna take a whole lot of flooring. Come on. There we go. Okay, so let's get back to that camp. I want to complete our first objective before we do anything crazy. How hard is it to take out an enemy camp? Well, we'll find out. Keep watching. We'll get to it eventually. These guys are sleeping. I could have been, like, an intruder. Oh, he's up now. Wait. Okay. Let's go back to our other camp. How are they doing now? Uh, settle. You want to settle here? Yes. A courses? No. Oh, how do I equip them with weapons now? They must have made some by now. Cancel. Uh, oh, what, what? Oh, I can make bows? Wait, baits and traps? Oh, that's cool. Oh, I can make... Oh, cool. I can trap animals that way? Dude, that is so cool. Oh, that's really cool. Let's go back to the camp. Upgrade camp. We need 20 boar tusks? Oh, how do I get boar tusks? I've been killing them like crazy. Hmm, I'll have to figure that out. A little Assassin's Creed and uh, Dead Red Redemption? Maybe. Why is this guy like getting all aggro? Order sets, add order. Well, they made one out of ten, so we should have one done now. Well, let's go to settle. Do you want to settle? Yes. Zero out of one warrior has... I don't know how to equip a person with a bow. Inventory is... How do I equip them? Interesting. I'm trying to give my uh, people weapons so I can send one out one out to build a camp. They all seem to be leaving the camp now. How do I tell them to like take a bow? Wait, now it says 0 out of 10. I thought I just... 
Okay, I guess more time has to pass for them to actually make it. Okay, not a problem. All right, let's... Can I sleep here? Wait, can I spend the night with you guys? Come on, let's play Nintendo. Let's have a party. Come on. This is pretty cool. Okay, let's see. All right, so in a little while, I guess they'll make the necessary bow and arrow. It's just going to take some time. But I could probably go back and make uh, make some at the actual camp. Now that I have a horse, that's kind of cool. Well, let's go back home. Let's go to... Uh, is there a way to fast travel here? Oh, sweet. Oh, you're too far from outpost or camp friendly camp. Oh, I can only do it when I'm near friendly camp? That's kind of weird. Oh, I guess these guys are neutral. Do I gotta go light that, then fast travel? Okay, that makes that makes sense. Herbs past time? They certainly do. All of those college students watching right now know that for sure. Everything's going good, Jesse. Just kinda learning the game a little bit. Actually it's daytime now, so let's just let's just go on horseback. We're gonna go back to our main camp, make some weapons, start building some other small camps, and then we'll come back here and recruit these guys or whatever we gotta do. So far it's beautiful. Like I certainly want this. Let's just uh proceed on horseback to our destination. Did I mark it? Guess we gotta mark it. It's on the other side of the river, so that's kinda cool. We have a camp next to the river. How do the guns work? Well, they work by igniting a uh, charge, which then ignites gunpowder, which propels a projectile forward through a tube, which is sometimes rifled to increase accuracy. And, uh, and then that has some sort of penetration power, greater improved upon whether or not it's like a bullet or whether or not it's like uh, an actual musket ball. Very big brain stuff. Oh, horsey, did you take damage coming down the cliff? I didn't know that. Seems like the horse actually auto-heals, so we're good there. So we just need to watch out for the wolfies. I guess we'll just take it slow. Wow, that really looks cool, though. It'd be nice if we could modify our character to be... Uh, you know, like, to wear, have different paint or something. What's up, Bailey? How you doing? How are you? Welcome to my, uh, my world. Okay, so we need to watch out for the wolves, but we're going to take a left up here and then head back to camp. I wish the daytime lasted a little longer, but that's my, that's my complaint for all games. Seems like nighttime is never over. I can add war paint? Cool. Can I add corporate logos like maybe Ford or Chevy? That'd be kind of cool. New subscriber shout out. Serenity, thanks for subbing. Welcome aboard. Oh yeah, there'll probably be a mod for Arthur Morgan or John Marston. That'd be cool. Okay, let's see. So our camp that we want to go to is there. We only have two guys out searching. Did one of them get killed? I thought there were three guys at that camp. Uh-oh. I hope we didn't lose anybody. Or maybe he's sleeping. Oh, that's John. He, You know him. He's lazy. Oh, you can't watch me as live as often? That's alright. You can always watch the, the VODs afterwards. Okay, so I want to go... the right then. Does it pop up on the thing? Well, I guess the marker does, but not the actual camp. Yeah, his name's Taco John. Jax, thanks for subbing. We're gonna get those potato lays, dude, and, and then that's how you beat the game. When you when you get up to making the fry later, and then you can craft the fry later, and then start your own franchise, and then start making potato lays, that's when you know you've reached the top. ba 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 Jersey King, thanks for seven. Oh, we're getting close to base now. These guys are going to be so jealous. I just got a new Mustang. These guys don't even have cars. 
Can you farm in this game? I suppose you could farm XP. Alright, so the camp is on the other side of uh, the river. I guess we'll cross. Wow, this looks so cool! Well, that's awesome. I can get a Pinto. Yeah, I wonder if he'll be in the game. Okay, we're back at main camp. Cool. Now, I wonder if I can give these guys weapons so we can get started earlier on this. Alright, you take, you take a rest. Alright, let's see. Uh... All right, let's go to... So where's the inventory? Is that here? Ah, uh, okay, so I can make my own arrows and then put them in there for these guys. So let me make, like, three of those so they can each have one. And then I will uh, put some arrows in there, too. Well, it looks like we can make all sorts of different bow and arrows, too. All different quality. It looks like I don't have enough items for it. What do I need to make those? Do I need more hickory? Yeah, we need to just go find more wood. Alright. Uh, any near camp? Alright. Time to go grab some more wood and make some more bows. Yeah, we have some sinew from killing the... What, there were horses here the whole time at camp and I didn't even notice that? Oh, that's alright. It made finding our own horse much cooler. Oh, that is so beautiful. I love this. I love this. This kind of feels a little bit like Skyrim. Just not like first person or anything, but it's giving me that, that Skyrim feel. Can I make an axe and cut stuff down? If I find... If I go near the river, could I find a stone and then like make my own axe and start cutting down some bigger trees? Would that work? I want to cut down a tree. I don't know if that's implemented, but... Yeah, the graphics are very beautiful here. It's an impressive looking game, and it's running rather smoothly. Oh, there's some flax there. Justin Hopper is now a little raptor! Thank you very much, Justin, for the support. New member, new welcome! Thank you very much. Oh, I can't use axes at the moment? Okay. Well, I'll have to axe the developers when those are coming out soon. But I'm, I'm sure they get a lot of requests. They'll have a splitting headache from all of the... Uh, just the constant bashing on the front door. Oh, I can make st stun arrows. That's interesting. Alright, new goal is to go and find flax and wood so we can keep making bows and arrows for our boys. And then we'll expand our camp. This is very basic, but I like this a lot. There's a lot of potential for this game, I feel. Thank you for the stream. It looks awesome. Well, thanks for dropping by, Sydney. It's very nice to have you here. Thank you for coming in and saying hello. Hope you're having a good day. Well, there's certainly a lot of trees over there, but I need to find, like, the little, the little saplings. So I guess we'll go up uh, this way. Oh, th this that that's just that is so cool. Look at that. There needs to be a photo mode in this game because it looks so beautiful. I would just like to stop and be able to take some photos, like in uh, No Man's Sky or. I think uh, Red Dead might have a photo mode too, or like uh, when we played, um, what was that one game with the zombies? I already forgot the name of it. Oh, Days Gone. 
That was a fun game. It feels a little bit like Days Gone, a little bit. Sorry I'm late to the stream. I had to watch your Frostpunk episode. It's awesome. Thanks for the new content, Dino. Phil Johnson, thank you very much for your support, my man. Game looks awesome. It certainly does. Uh, try F12 for a photo. Well, I want a photo mode. But I know you can take screenshots, but I want the ability to, like, zoom out. But look at this. This looks amazing. Look at... Oh, that's that's just cool. That is that is cool. A VR mode would be cool? Yeah. Certainly a, a VR game. Possible. Alright, so we're out looking for... I'm looking for little trees like this so we can make some bow and arrows for our, our team. So there's a few here. We got lucky. I probably passed a bunch, but whatever. Oh, you guys know what this is, actually? This is... This is actually... Uh, the game is called A Walkthrough Bob Ross Painting. Can we get a bunch of Bobby Rosses in chat? Look at all these. Like, look, guys. It's just Bob Ross now. Now it's just Bob Ross. Now it's just a... We're just exploring a Bob Ross painting. Little did you know, every time Bob Ross did a painting, he was actually just making a... Uh, open world exploration game and nobody nobody had any idea don't you go anywhere horse okay oh okay, I don't know how much wood I need to make bows but let's see if we can make another one and I I I think they might have durability or whatnot so but there's always it's always a good idea to have extra extra wood for stuff we're taking all the young and happy trees yeah, we're going to bring them to uh, Dr. Bob Ross's uh, school for talent, gift, young gifted trees. Oh, sorry, Susan. Copyright. All right, guys, I'm getting shut down. Well, thanks to everybody who supported. I'm being banned. Hi from Dubai. Well, hello. How are you? All right. Well, let's bring back our... Oh, I should make some uh, arrows, too. Maybe we'll give each one of our boys... Oh, I need more crafting items. What do I need for that? More wood. Okay. Is that not a sapling? There it is. Okay, we need a little bit more. This reminds you of Rust. I haven't played Rust since the early days. Is it, is it good now? Is Rust, like, gotten better? Is it still just kind of, like, grind with server trolls? Like, whoever whoever owns the server always hacks in a bunch of materials, and they show up with, like, 26 of their friends and just, like, attack somebody who has, like, a can of beans. Get on, get on the horse. There we go. Okay. I think we need to keep finding some more trees, though. Oh, there goes a the deer. I also want to go back and play some Space Engineers. It's been a while since I played uh, Rust and Space Engineers. Okay, that's why games in this... Uh, days in this game need to, to last for a very long time. Because it is so beautiful. This actually reminds me of uh, going... If you've ever gone hunting before, this really rem makes me miss the... Uh, you know, when you go out hunting with uh, Granddad or something. Here we go. We got a we got a big old. Is that a big buck? Oh, he saw me. Oh, that. Oh, he, that's a that's a big boy. That is that is a big. That's almost like a stag level. Let's go see if we can track him down. Let's go on a hunt. All right, guys. I need everybody's energy. Can we get some lemons in chat for the uh, the power to hunt this deer? And one like equals one venison jerky. If you guys are hungry. Where did he go? 
Well, if he went too far, I won't be able to find him, but... New subscriber shout-out. Well, the horse goes much faster. I'm just keeping him slow for purposes of finding a deer. Great, now we're playing uh, Hunt Call of the Wild all of a sudden. Alright, $10 say I'm going to be eaten by a bear now. Alright, we'll come back another time. I think he, he certainly ran off. Oh, looks like there's another camp up here too. There he is. Ooh! shows deer hunting ground to our right. But there's a bit of a cliff there. Okay, let's... Oh, I'm going to pull over. And put the parking brake on. You guys, need, you guys are going to need to bear with me. We're going to go find a deer. Okay, I, I want to do a hunt now. Okay, chat. Okay, he's up to our... We can go up to the right, but I'm going to go left. Alright, you guys remember where we parked. We parked by that tree. Don't forget. Okay, here we go. Shh. We need to find a big old deer. Got a long way to go. Do you actually need to eat in this game? Uh, I think not, but killing a deer would be pretty sweet. Although this is a pretty weak bow, so I might not get him. But if I hit him, at least we'll uh, we'll see. Are deer active during the night? New subscriber shout out. Uh, not not in the real life. They they bed down for the evening, but. This is a game, so they could just be wandering around. I haven't seen any animals sleeping. Okay, so it should be up here to the right. Oh, I can hear him walking around. So it's a Homer Simpson. Ma'am, where's your husband? Where's the big boy? Yeah, this does look like Skyrim, doesn't it? Oh, there he is. Well, there's no honor in killing him while he's sleeping. Jack, close your eyes for a second. I heard I hear if you close your eyes, like if you'll you'll see like a, a fun funny color. Oh, oh, guys, we found a deer over here. 
Oh, dear. Oh, that's a big one there, John. Yeah. Wow. Holy crap. That is huge. Look at how big that... Oh, my. That's huge. That is... That's a... That's big O. Wow. Three meat from that big boy. Woo! -hoo! Technically, he woke up before I killed him. I didn't kill him. He just kind of, you know, cholesterol. Cholesterol. You guys got to be very careful about cholesterol. A mule deer? Was that not a white tail? Ah, who cares? I got myself a deer. That's awesome. Ma'am, your husband's uh, gone to the grocery store for cigarettes. He'll be back never. All right, but that's just the way. That's just the way it is. Yeah, that's a tender rump roast. That's for sure. Okay, let's go back to the horse and grab a bunch of uh, bows and make some other camps. Can I take the skin with me? Uh, I don't think I can. I did skin it. I don't think I could do anything else to it. I don't. I took the sinew and the meat, but I don't think I can take skin or anything. Can I? Oh, skinning and pelts require upgrades. Oh, can I get that upgrade? Hunter. Hunting one improves chance of finding more meat sinew when skinning animals up to fifty percent. Oh, okay, that just gives more meat. Oh, I need this one. Skinning one. Improves chances to get pelts when skinning animals. Okay, so I needed a lot more XP for that one. But right now we can only get meat and sinew. That's fine. Oh, gathering could be improved, though. Chance of finding more flint, wood, leaf, mushrooms. That's good. That'll be good for our bow and arrows. Uh, Chief, warrior, scout, endurance one. Oh, a spyglass. Allows you to use a spyglass for scouting. Huh? That might be good. Improved intimidation. Decreases intimidation time by nine seconds. Okay. New subscriber shout out. Bow accuracy increase. Weapon damage plus one. Oh, that seems pretty useful. Let's do that. Let's increase the uh, damage of our bow and arrow. Okay, let's go back to the horse. Oh, you can, Okay. So we'll get pelts as we become more skilled. That was certainly a good deer to practice on, but I'm sure there's some big boys out there somewhere. Now, where's the horsey? Uh, what is that? Trading post? What? Oh, we can trade? Wow, there's all sorts of cool stuff here. How do I find the horse? Where'd he go? Uh-oh. Let's just go down this way. We should be able to slide down here. There we go. Oh, I can't get that tree. Alright, we can do the spyglass next. We'll do the spy kids. We'll go for spy kids next. Oh, where'd the horse go? Uh, oh, he's over here. Oh, what is this? Oh, wow, boar pelts? Oh, yeah, medicine? Ooh, whiskey. We got ourselves some whiskey, boys. You know what? Now I can just walk up to the trading post and be like, Oh, look at all this stuff I found. Oh, there's a letter. I found a letter. It's addressed to Keel... Eerie, with instructions on how to get to my camp. It also says where I can be found. I need to get to him before he gets to me. Uh-oh, we're being hunted by somebody. Oh, there's a trading post over here. Yeah, fire water, yeah. Hmm. Open the letter? I did, didn't I? Oh, finding the root of all evil... Find an old camp and take leftover item. Oh, I didn't know there was... Oh, this is the mission here. Okay, this is interesting. Uh, let's let's just get back to our camp first. Or, all right. Goal one, find horse. Two, go back to camp. How can he read English? Well, he went to... I think he's a college graduate. Yale or something. Hmm... This is just awesome. This, this is this is really cool. There's a lot of potential here for something that could be like dead red, 
Redemption, but a little Red Dead Redemption, but kind of on the Native American side. It's kind of cool that you can craft stuff and build up armies, and you know, it's not like a triple A EA game. So that's nice. Oh, look, guys, a deer. Oh, this one doesn't even have horns. Here we go. Sneak up on it. Okay. Oh, look. Oh, he doesn't even know I'm here. Okay, here we go. Cool, I, I tamed a deer. How can I... Wait, how am I doing this? Am I riding dirty right now? That's... Oh, that's the gangsta lean. Nice. Oh, there's... Some animal's having a really bad night. I think it's having a nightmare. We'll just kind of pass through. All right, now I got a broken leg. Now I'm... Well, let me try to get off. There we go. It's an early access game. You know how it is. The great thing about these uh, types of games, though, is that the community can give a lot of feedback as to what they want to see and how they want things to go. And the developers, in most cases, are willing to listen because one, the community is usually right about a lot of stuff in terms of like historical accuracy or requesting features and then two a lot of people get to kind of test it along the way so smaller companies can actually have a more quality game but you just have to be patient for it but ever since the days of uh, minecraft where everybody bought minecraft before it was done a lot more people are more believing of these types of games in their long-term success so that's kind of cool hey Hayes, how you doing hey raptor you rule you too thank you very much that horse is a bug resetter. Yeah, it fixes things. He's he's a he's a Bell is a real fixer. That's what we named our Oh, we need a name for our bow. Next person to click or tap the join button gets to uh, name our bow. We can call it Is anyone named Bow Jangles? Goodbye, bugs. Is there anything here? Apple beverage. Oh, I, I love me some apple beverage. Fried fish, sausages. Oh, oh, boys, we're gonna have that pizza made in no time. We got mushrooms. Now we gotta do is find an onion. That is awesome. David Bowie. Well, it all depends on who becomes the next member. Now you wait there, horsey. I'm gonna look around for some hickory. You know, what'd be really cool is to just find a gun like laying next to a tree or something. Wow, that was really close to our camp. Well, that's cool. Oh, oh. Okay, I gotta, gotta put it in reverse. Backing out. Okay, there we go. It's kind of hard to drive a horse. You gotta learn how to do the manual. and They don't make them like they used to, by the way. I'm your favorite YouTuber? Well, thank you, DJ. That's alright. If I, if I use the take all button, I can just drop stuff off at camp. And we're not close to our weight limit yet. Well, we are close to it, but we're not, we're not there. I keep hearing what sounds like mountain lions or something growling. Okay, we got a way to go to get get to camp. Good idea to keep your eyes peeled for any sort of like uh, camps or something like that. Yeah, there are wolves in the game. Wolves, boars, and uh, deer I've seen so far, but no no bears yet, so we'll see. Long dong neck beard. Well, thank you very much for the 20 Swedish kroner. Tax to make it, bro. Well, let's just head back to the camp. And see if we can expand and then have some other homies join our, our gang. This river is beautiful. Mm -hmm. 
Oh yeah, I've seen bunnies too. All right, let's head back to camp. What's the name of my gang? Uh, the Grilled Cheese Gang. We're at war with the Tomato Soup Clan. A lot of people say we could get along great if we just set apart our distances, but uh, our differences. But you just bought this game right now, thanks to me. Cool. I mean, explore exploring is a lot of fun here. It, it certainly has a, a lot more depth to it than I thought it would. It's not like a shallow kind of like cheese game. It's actually got a little little bit to it. All right, let's pull over. Wow. You guys brought back some boars? Nice work. Cool. All right. Nice work. And they actually carry the bow and arrow too. Hmm. All right, now I need to put one in camp. Let's go back to loot. Put another one in the camp. There we go. And arrows. Put those in there too. Oh, we have 28. Uh, I'll just take 10 of those. There we go. Okay, now let's see if we can send out our troopers. Let's go to... Uh, two warriors working. What happened to our third warrior? Did somebody die? I thought we had three people here. Alright, go settle that. Equip. With a wooden bow and an arrow. Send. Wait, warrior needs... Oh, rope! I need to make rope. How do I make rope? Let's see. Oh. Not enough craft items. We need more flax. Okay. Well, let's go walk around and look for flax. Now we got to make our boys some ropes so they can set up some camps. That shouldn't be too hard. Is this flax here? No, that's nothing. Now we'll... Suspect shall proceed on foot. Is there a tutorial on how do you save? You go to, um... You go to little camps and outposts. Although I would argue it would be nice if you could save it like your main camp. I don't, I don't know if you can actually save at your main camp. But, alright, so we need a lot more flax so we can make ropes and then we can make camps and then we should be able to ally with other... Should be able to ally with other uh, camps and stuff. Let's go to... Uh, by the way, if you haven't already, make sure you click or tap that subscribe button so you don't miss out on when we play this again. This is certainly a game we'll be playing tomorrow. I see there's quite a bit to do here and to go explore and to, and to pick up, so that's kind of cool. Here's some flax here, yep. We just need to find, looks like light light blue or white flowers. And we're good. But I'll grab everything. I don't know what rarity is on stuff. Yeah, and don't forget to sneak in before 300 likes, too. Appreciate everyone and their support. Alright, let's see. Oh, there's some more flax there. Game looks amazing. Yeah, it's pretty cool so far. And if it's moddable, you could recreate things like um, the bear attack from... Uh, oh, what was that movie? Oh, man. What was that movie with uh, Leonardo DiCaprio? Or who, who... I don't... Yeah, that was like a million years ago. Such a good movie. It started with a D, didn't it? He gets attacked by the bear, and there's like a whole fur trading company, and then he tries to avenge his dead son, Revenant. Oh, okay. It didn't start with a D, but... A Hass with the 10 Swedish Kroner, Taximikit, and Skeledelvis. Nice to see you in this type of game, too, with the 20 Danish Kroner. Thank you. You guys are super awesome. If you guys want to support me like that, too, uh, please do consider becoming members as well. That way you get something out of it in return, and also get to use all of our emotes and help to unlock more. You're a bad speller? Oh, don't worry about it. I've actually noticed I become worse after I've gotten out of school. I just... I'm not i am not as good of a speller as I once was, and it kind of is, like, frightening at how many words get underlined when I write an email. Like, I know how to spell certain words, but when they come out on my fingers, it's, like, completely trash. It's like, good morning, Joanne. How are you? It's great to... 
it was great to see you at the at the meeting. You know, and it just comes out like Q seven smiley face emoji four 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 three. And it's like how does that how does that work? Yeah, we can make two rope. Oh I get I get XSP for crafting. That's so cool. Yeah, I don't know how much rope we need, so let's just keep looking. You're watching on your phone, hard to see the title. Can anyone tell me the name of this game? The name of this game is This Land is My Land. I think you should be able to if you tap on the on the name of it too, it should expand and show you the full title. I actually really like this. There's something peaceful about f frolicking around and picking flowers. <laughs> Local 94, thank you very much. You are the name of our bow, by the way. We'll call it uh, Glocal. We'll call it our Glock. I'm going to bust out my Glock when I make another bow. I think I dropped our other one off at camp, but we can always make another one. Thank you very much for your support. Welcome New aboard. Member. Let's get some Welcome. tasty Bobby Rosses and some talented Hot Pockets in chat. Jonas, thank you for becoming a member as well. You guys are awesome. Thank you for becoming little raptor hatchlings. Thank you, and welcome aboard. You guys are great. Thank you, thank you. New member, welcome. Ah, this is really fun. I, I just like frolicking around in the woods and picking flowers. It really suits my, my style, doesn't it? <laughs> oh yeah, three more members, and we do hit our goal for tonight, but... I guess it, if we don't hit it, it's still, it's still nice to see everyone's support. Thank you for smashing like if you can't become a member or just subscribing. Maybe it's less spelling, but the typing that's gotten worse? No. I, I know how to spell these words, but it's just... I think I forget... Yeah, maybe you're right about that. My Most of my spelling errors... Well, whenever I try to write something in length, it's always on the computer. Like, I'm not going to write out a long email. You ever have those moments where you're like... Oh, crap. You ever have those oh crap moments where you're being chased through the woods by a bear? Oh god. Oh boy. Go baby, go! Oh boy. Oh that, okay. That's, that's bad. That's, uh, that's... That's bad. Sir? Go, boy. Go, go, go. Oh, we're running out of stamina. Oh, no. Oh, so did the bear. Oh, no, he's back. No! Go, bro. I don't know. I can't. There. That's the last time I leave home without my gun. <laughs> no, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Ah. <laughs> Oh, I was knocked down. I wasn't killed. I just, I got tipped over. Oops. Climb a tree? Can you do that? Roll takes stamina? Oh, boy. Oh, I had a lot of flax there. Oh, we're at Detroit Farms now. Okay, let's get our horse and not let that happen again. Can I find my body and just get all that stuff? Well, that was, uh, that was the bite of 87, I think. Where's my horse? Well, that was, uh... Oh, I still have all my stuff? Oh. Well, that's cool. So there was, like, really no consequence for that. Wow, I picked a lot of flax and I only made two rope out of that? Jeez. Okay, well... That was... Uh, that was... That was unbearable. You know, when you get into a grisly situation like that, sometimes you just gotta pause and take a moment to, you know. Alright, well, where's the horse? Is there a way I can find the horse now? Dying is just a quick travel back to base? Oh, so we didn't even, like, it wasn't even really that big of a deal. Well, I, we had a lovely encounter with a bear. That was great. That bear had some incredible stamina. That was interesting. <laughs> I could have got out of there if, if I had my horse with me. 
The horse is inside the bear now. Oh, that's where it goes. Okay, we'll have to go talk to him about that and see if we can get our uh, horse back. I lost 100 skill points. Oh, that's okay. We can get them all back by crafting more stuff. And Yeah, it's all good. Okay, so let's send our... Po Wait, did we make our first camp? Wait, what happened to the one guy I sent out to settle a camp? Did I not... You? Oh, yeah, I couldn't, because I, I needed rope. Ten rope? Oh, my... This is going to take forever. Let's see. How much rope do we have? Inventory rope is... Oh, we have ten. Okay, we have 10 rope. So let's send him out to go settle. We still got to do this a few times, though, so. Um, so. Settle there. Yes. Equip group with bow and wood. 20 wood to set up. A, oh, we need 20 rope. 10 rope and 20 wood, too. Oh. Wow, so I gotta grab a lot of stuff. Um, what do we have for wood? Ten? Ten wood, ten rope. So we just need ten more wood, but then we need to do it like three times. So we need a lot more materials, so that'll be fine. Is the horse still out there, though? Can I find the horse again? Or do I just take... Should I just take a different one? Like, do they respawn at base or what? Oh, this looks like our horse. I think our horse was actually, like, black with, like, a, a white nose. It was kind of cool. All right, you stay here. We'll go see if we can find the other horse. Is there a way to... Is there a way, like, you can transport one horse with another horse? Like, if you if you find another horse and, like, tie them together and lead it back to base, is there a way to do that yet? In the meantime, our goal, then, is to find a bunch of flax, like this, and then also a bunch of trees. And maybe to build a bow. If I could kill those bears, that would be nice. I should make a bow, actually, so we don't have oops happen again. Oh, I do have a bow now. Well, how come I couldn't pull it out? Oh, I didn't press one. Oh, there it goes. Well, it's not like I was going to stop a bear with a bow anyway. Killing a bear gives you 100 SP. That's a risk I guess I'm willing to take. Now, now. Relax. We're just going to go find some trees and flax and be all peaceful. Can you make animal traps? Yep, it looks like you can. It looks like you can do animal trapping and uh, luring and stuff. One shot to the head will kill a bear? Oh, with a war... Yeah, well, I don't have the war bow. I got I to gotta upgrade and get up to that level. Well, I don't, I don't think... This is like a kind of a crappy bow. Ten bow and arrow with that. I could have just gotten away if I had my horse, but I got off because I found a ton of uh, materials. But we'll continue up this way. We'll do round two against uh, the Mike Tyson of animals. And which way did we go for that bear? I think it was the other way, wasn't it? Near the road? Yeah, I think we'll head down the river. Yeah, I do like this game a bit. It has some similarities to Red Dead because, you know, you're gathering in the Old West, but there's a lot of differences, too. And I found a ton of stuff, and even though I got mauled by a bear once, at least I still have all my stuff. So we really didn't lose any progress, which is nice because I'm still kind of learning how to watch out for danger and stuff. Maybe we can go find our horse back again. 
The last time I stayed along the river. Let's grab some of this flax here. Yeah, there'll be trains in the game in a future update. We want to build a lot of rope, and I need more wood. This would be a lot easier if I could actually cut down a tree. But we found the found a, a gold mine here. <laughs> Being chased by a bear. I wish the bears would make more noise. I kind of... Is there a way to call your horse? Uh, they don't have cell phones in the game yet. They might... They're waiting, I think, to get, like, uh, licensing from either Android or Apple. Any more trees? Looks like we got them all. Heading towards the scene of the crime. Oh yeah, it was down here by this road, wasn't it? Okay. Alright. We're going to try to kill that bear. It was near the road, right? So it was probably near this crossroad there. Oh yeah, because they were backed up against the mountains. So like, probably down there, but alright. Rob the Cowboys? I mean, we can actually raid their camps, but... Smoke signal for tacos. No, I'd probably just order Uber Eats. Oh, I miss our old horse. Oh, well. It doesn't really matter. Horses are kind of just like... They're just like a car. It's not like they upgrade or anything, so there's no real reason to, like, keep one, I guess. Doesn't seem like they gain stamina by running further or whatever. Hey, well, we found tons of flax, so the rope problem will be solved. Um, I don't see any more New subscriber hickory out. around. Also, thanks for seven. Oh, wait, there's some. Local, thanks for uh, dropping by. All right, we're on our we're on a bear hunt now. Wow, look at how pretty this is, though. There are objectives in the game, but kind of just walking around and finding stuff is kind of kind of fun on its own. How much grinding is there? Uh, well, we have yet to set up a tool shop. And, uh... I don't know if we're... Gonna be grinding or if we're gonna just be using, like, uh... I don't know. Uh, we can't hunt bears yet? No, not yet. I mean, I guess I could tell them to, but... Ice man, thanks for seven. Oh, look at all this cool stuff here. Oh yeah, well, good. We got some hickory. If I find the bears, I'll kill them. But uh, right now, I just want the flax so I can continue on with the camp. Looking around is just beautiful. Like it's really immersive to be out here. It looks gorgeous. I think it's more immersive to be in third person than first. It's like we can see our character and. Yeah, looks really cool. Wow, the, the lighting looks gorgeous. Just beautiful. There we go. 
Reminds you of Red Dead a little? Yep, I get that same feeling too. But I guess it's just the landscape that really brings in that uh, feeling for me. Alright, we're going to go a little further down the river and then I'll turn back around. I don't know where I was when I got killed last time. Uh, Q doesn't work when I'm on a horse, though. Alright, I think we're going to turn around and go back to camp after I grab a few more trees. Let's see. Yeah, the scenery's beautiful. And the fact that we can build camps and expand our clan is pretty cool. Alright, I think we'll turn around here and head back. Wow, look at that. Okay, let's head back to camp. Do, 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 do. So James, rather than spamming the chat, all you got to do is just check the description where you can find the schedule down below. And you'll see what I'm up to for the remainder of the month. Yeah, we're, explain uh, we're ancient Raptorians. We're uh, on the hunt for uh, flax and wood in order to start making our first uh, World War One bombers. We're just going to Huts back to base real slow and see if we can find any uh, any bears and or any more uh, materials. Swing over here. I think the bears. I think they might be over here. Maybe they migrated. Yeah, it's not a problem there, James. I usually get the same questions all night. It's usually, uh, why the sunglasses? What's the name of this game? When are you playing? Blank game. And all those questions can be answered either in the description or the title. But I usually just have to mention it a few times a night. Which is fine. What I signed up for. Alright, let's head back to camp. And uh, have our boys start building their camps. We're looking for bears now. Uh, they're looking for me. So I guess we really don't have to go looking for bears. I think they're they're awfully hungry. I certainly found one uh, by accident. I wonder if there'll be foxes and stuff. and uh, Like mountain lions and all that. That'd be cool. It'd be really neat if you could go to like different areas of the map and it would represent different areas of the west. What game is this? You know, like maybe the Colorado Rockies. Oh, there's a deer. Wait a minute, there's a little tent over there. Well, let's go check the tent. One thing I can say about this game is it, is it, it is pretty intense. Oh, look, guys, it's an ancient Kmart. Oh, wow. It looks like the ones of today. We have Brass Teapot. Oh, that's my favorite song. Brass Teapot. A funky teapot, a boda bag. Is that for drinking wine? We have a thirty. We have a thirty-eight, three thirty-eight rounds, melon tonic, and a letter. If this letter is accurate, Clay Grove is in desperate need of wood. I must not let them get it. How are you going to stop them from getting wood, dude? Burn down the forest? What? How, how would you stop? <laughs> There's all these trees around. What are you going to do? Ask the trees. Hey, trees, if you could just not give him any wood. Oh, okay. Not a problem, chief. Take all is quicker? Maybe, but I kind of like counting it off as I as I click so I know what I have in my inventory. Which we're actually full on. I wonder if that means we're over encumbered. Oh, cool. Now we're over encumbered. Oh, that's cool. You can carry more stuff, but you're just a you're just a thick boy now, so we got to go back to we got to go back to camp. We're overloaded as it says at the bottom. So we got a lot of stuff to drop off back at camp. We're coming in for a uh, coming in for a uh, FedEx delivery. Oh, I can't grab any more. Oh, there we go. Cannot have enough flax and wood though. It seems. 
All right, let's head on back to the old camp. You can't ride while overloaded? You can't tell me what to do, game. Don't make me drink that melon tonic. Oh, man. It'd be really good to trade, like, the brass teapot and stuff at the... There's a trading center nearby, like, over here somewhere. Well, I guess we'll just make stuff. Can I make stuff, and will it change the weight? Like, if I make rope, will it just stack and weigh less? Is it working? Oh, it is. Okay. Ah, uh, we're still point two over encumbered. Uh oh. Uh what if I make more wooden arrows? How does that work? Ah, there we go. Now we can ride. Perfect. And we'll just head back to base up to the left. Alright, so let's go make this other camp now. We need to go basically just follow the river now. Lay off the hot pockets? Yeah, that, that would certainly be me, wouldn't it? All right, horsey, let's go back to base. Nice. All right, let's head over here. So let's drop off more wood. Oh, yeah, 16. Beautiful. Is there a way to select more than one? Seems like I have to do it one at a time. Oh, we made lots of rope. Uh, these are all consumables. And what is that teapot under goods? I better leave... I better keep that, actually. Okay, let's send everybody out on some missions. So, let's see. Main camp. Settle. Nearby. Uh, yes, I would like to settle here. Equip group. Give to warriors. Okay. And then he only needs ten, right? Oh, he needs twenty wood. Oh, oh okay. We need one more wood. Man, you need... This game is... Okay, I need to open up a lumber yard. I mean, it makes sense. Their camps are, like, look at all that stuff. It's all made out of wood, so it makes sense. All right, I'll come back. Hopefully we can find a forest somewhere. I'm going to need a lot of wood. This is my favorite part, dude. Crossing rivers is so awesome. It's so cool. Okay, let's go look for some more wood. So each camp requires 20. 20 wood, 10 rope. So we need to keep on hunting for stuff. This actually is a little bit of a grind for the start, I'd say. But at least it gets the player used to, like, exploring and uh, familiar with the landscape and what they can and can't do. When do we get the fire water? Jolly Jerry, fire can't start on water. <laughs> what a noob. All right, let's see. Yeah, I wanna, I'm trying to become, uh, if I upgrade my character enough, I can become uh, Chief Boyardi and make some of the best Skedios in town. Now, you know what? Raptor, do not get too far away from your horse. Don't do it. Last time you got attacked by a bear. Uh, can you get on there? There we go. Once you have more warriors, you can keep... 
keep them all gathering so you can craft more and get SP. Oh, so the beginning is just like a little bit of a hump once you get more people in your camp. Also, but I had three guys. What happened to the one dude? Did one of the guys leave our camp and join four other guys and begin the restaurant chain known as Five Guys? I guess we'll just keep looking around for, for stuff. I really do like just this gathering. There's something peaceful about just walking around like this. Actually, I missed a couple of flax. I can send them to different camps. Can I send up my warriors out to do some of this stuff? Like, um... Oh, wait a minute. Didn't I... T wait a minute. Didn't I tell all my guys to go out and gather stuff? Eight wood, nine wood, camp inventory. Oh, that's right. I've been telling them to craft uh, bow and arrows and stuff, though. Okay, well, let's cancel that bow and arrow order. And let's cancel the order for bows. So let's just tell them to gather. Let's just have them gather wood and flax again. One warrior has no weapon. That's fine. Nothing really near camp. Gather. New subscriber shout out. One's gathering wood, and the other one's gathering wood. Flax I can do myself, so that's fine. Okay, so now I've told them to gather wood, and I'll just go look for wood and flax too, and then we should be fine. I wonder, why is the camp X'd out now? Not enough warriors to send the group. <laughs> Wait, four warriors are working, but there's only two. I'm, I'm confused. Now we're just going to grab the rest of the materials. So when the warriors come back, I'll reset them to gather like just a ton of wood. and We'll gather wood too, and then flax, and then we'll make another camp. But apparently we have four warriors, so I have no idea what that means. But I'll figure it out. Oh. This seems like an area for a boss battle. Are we going to have to fight like a polar bear? Oh, there it is, a polar bear! Oh god, it's dangerous and deadly. Look at it. The game starts you with horses and doesn't make you have to, like, go and find them. Ah. Pricky pear infusion, wooden bow. Oh, that's good. Puffball infusion. What is all this crafting and stuff? Like, are we going to make potions? Oh, great. Now we're overweight again. Uh, let's make some more... Have some more rope. Oh, what? Oh, I'm plus 20 overweight? Wow. Uh... Oh, I can learn from stuff. Oh... I'm assuming that number is the weight. Wow, we are like severely over encumbered now. Mm. Well, we don't need meat and sinew for anything, do we? Well, we might be able to trade it. I don't know what it goes for. But we need to drop 11. Man, what did I pick up that was so heavy? Pricky pear infusion is eight? Are you kidding me? Why is that so...
Stamina for 30 seconds. Okay. Yeah, whatever. Let's head back to camp. Pear infusion is a health potion. Okay. Now well, that explains why that's so heavy. I can always come back here. I'll remember that it's near the river in the south section. Okay, let's go back to camp. And we'll set those guys to grab more materials. Da 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 da. No bears, no bears, no bears. Won't be. I wonder if there's skunks. Oh, do I like the game? It's pretty good. As I'm learning, you know how it is when you first learn a game. You're like, I have no idea what I'm doing, and then by like uh, your first or second hour, you're starting to get the hang of things and figure out how it all works. And you kind of start to feel what the average. Uh, thing requires. So there's our camp there. And we are good. Uh, what's the plan? Any storyline? There is a storyline. Apparently there's somebody who is trying to hunt us and figure out where we are. And we're trying to, like, we're trying to find them and kill them before they find and kill us. But it, it, it's a little vague right now, so I'm not sure exactly what's going on. But somebody wants us dead and we don't know why. But we got to kill them before they kill us. We're finding, like, little leather, letters and stuff of what's going on. All right, so that's good. I'll just leave all this poison here at camp. I'm sure the guys will appreciate that. Oh, that's a healing potion there. All right, let's leave the ammo. Leave a bow here. I, don't, I really don't know what a lot of this stuff is for. I'm assuming I can craft stuff with it. So let's just let's just leave everything at base, and uh, I'll come back. We'll do a supply run, because I, I found that trading post near camp, so if we need to, we can run there. Promo, thanks for subbing. Appreciate that. Welcome to the new members, people clicking and tapping join and hanging out. Thank you very much for all that. Is food for health? Oh, you can get you can get health from food. Okay, that's good. Well, all I need is some Tabasco and some... Oh, actually, medicine. Well, there's no eating system implemented in the game just yet. But at least we can gather all the stuff like uh, food and whatnot. So that's cool. But survival like that will be a part of it. Instead of killing the bear, become one with the bear. That's a good idea. Do you think we could sit down and have like a, you know, like a, like the UN? Maybe we could have like a discussion. I think the only discussion the bears know, though, is, uh, you know, physical discussion. All right. Now, how come I can't give goals to these guys or quit? Click to open camp menu. I can't give them orders. Not enough warriors to send to the group. How do I modify orders that I currently have? Grab wood. 200. Confirm. I don't know what I'm doing. That's quite obvious, YouTuber. That's true. <laughs> Wait, now there's three people here at the camp? Wait a minute, what is this? Uh... Still can't give orders, though. Am I going to have to gather all the wood myself? Dude, I have very bad insomnia. Your vids kept me to sleep. This isn't an insult. Thank you. Well, thank you, Mike. Guys, Mike D. saying that Raptors videos puts him to sleep. If that's uh, testimony enough to become a uh, subscriber, there you go. They're all returning to camp? Oh, good. All right, let's see. Now let's do a gather order. So let's send... Oh, but I can only put one 
Why could I only do one warrior on this job? I want, like... I want all of them to gather wood. And I can only set it to one? Two? Oh, send two warriors, yes, to gather wood. But how do I set the limit of wood now? Take horses. No, you don't need to take horses for that. Oh, now we have three. Okay, yeah, three warriors to gather wood. So now we got three warriors back. Beautiful. Zero out of three have weapons. Don't care. You guys don't need weapons to go cut down a tree. Let me see if I can add an order, because I know I could select it that way. Love that band name, Brown Mushroom Infusion. That is, that is, I'm going to start a band and call it that. Selected item already ordered. Order sets. Current orders, none. I have nothing in the upper left corner. Add an order. New 200. Shout out. Jan, thanks for subbing. Uh, well, let me confirm. Selected item already ordered. Uh-oh. Got a little bit to wor learn with this one. I must become one with the bear. This is your first stream? Cool. Welcome aboard. I don't I don't see any work order. Like I'm tr I'm just trying to tell our people in the camp to like go and gather stuff now. So, how? Hi there, Pinto. I want 3 warriors to gather wood. Camp inventory orders 200 items of wood. Oh, there it goes. All right, for somehow I figured it out. I I think I got it. So the order here, I know I'm in a bad spot, but I think no matter where I put myself on the screen for this game, it's, it's going to be bad. Okay, so now they've gathered 56 out of 200, so there we go. So now they're going to go gather the rest, I think. Okay, let's do, um, what do we got here in loot? Give me the loot, give me the loot. Hi there, Peter, how you doing? Okay, so wood is now at 56, and rope is at 22, so we can make two camps. But I need to get three. So if each of them requires... Oh, actually, look at that. My land is at 4.1%. 4 oh, that's... Oh, we need to get more than this dude. Ah. So his land is here. Oh, oh God. Wait, that's 5.1%? He only... That, okay. All right. Okay. Well, before we finish this, let's uh, grab some more flax. Because I need to make more ropes. And then we'll do another one there. All right, so we're almost there. Even when I do this, we're still going to need more rope and more flax anyway. It seems to always be necessary. So let's do another supply run, and we'll wait for the boys to come on back. Looks like those guys standing around are like security, and then there's other people who are out on like an actual job. Cool. All uh, there we go. Yeah, I'll be playing Seven Days to Die with Pinto sometime soon. He's been playing a little bit of that. That'll be fun. Make peas with the bear? Uh, we could make a nice stew with the bear. Do you guys remember when Binging with Babish went out to the woods to make, like, uh, bear stew? And he added other things to it, like, uh, I think he added, like, beef and bacon and just a bunch of random, random stuff you'd get as a cowboy. And just made, uh, some stew out in the woods. That Binging with Babish. I love it when he does stuff from video games. That's really cool. All right, we're going to grab some more flax. And we want to expand this camp. Even though this has taken me forever, this is awesome. Like, this isn't the type of game you're going to be rushing through. This is a game that you should take your time with and, like, get immersed in the world. And I'm glad the only thing I died to was a bear. Because it would have been em embarrassing if I would have died to, like, a river or falling off of a cliff. Okay, any trees around here? Looking for some more trees. Ah, this YouTuber sucks. Mom, where's my hot pocket? 
pocket. Oh, there's a hot pocket right there, Billy. Look, majestic in all of its ways. Okay, the camp has 56 wood still. Uh, there, there are herbs that you can smoke, yeah, to pass time. Like how you could in Metal Gear Solid 5 when you could use the vape pen. So if you don't... If you want to, um... If you want to pass time and can't find a camp, that apparently is the way to do it. Yeah, I think I'm better than anybody in our crew at finding flax and uh, trees. Hickory. I'm very good at that now. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh yeah, yeah. Don't don't give me too many hints in the game, because as I've been finding, I've been having a lot of fun by not knowing how to do things, but by kind of just figuring it out, or chat just saying, "Oh, just press this button," and it's like, "Oh, okay, that's good." Besides, the game could change at any time. All the stuff that I'm doing now could be uprooted and changed completely when the game comes out. Like. Maybe in the future they'll start you with a camp already and they'll have you do something else. I mean, who knows? But it's there's a lot of promise here. It certainly feels like a more complete world than what I was expecting. And I'm glad it's not like a bunch of, uh, you know, planes or something like that. YouTuber, there can't be planes. This is 1993. Yeah, that's true. A time before smartphones and before common internet. We had to do this, kids. This is how things used to look back in 93. I need a spirit quest? Uh, yeah. Uh, maybe, uh, maybe some gin. Or whatever, sure. Uh, wait. 74, okay. Well, I certainly need a lot more uh, SP now, but I get that from killing animals and stuff. Right now, we're like progressing the base. Okay. How are we doing for ropes now? We have 11 flax. What's the crafting ratio to that? Isn't it like 5? Oh yeah, oof. Wow. Oh, what's my spirit animal? Uh, pff, Chicken McNugget. Yeah, apparently we can have uh, guns and stuff in this game, too, so it's quite quite interesting to see that it's not just kind of like a... It's not necessarily just a survival game, though there will be elements of that when it gets a little closer to completion. I'm assuming the most difficult thing to do in a game like this is to balance, like, the food and the water and the, and the trading system and, like, consumption and all that. Like, how often do they want the player to actually have to drink water and eat something. But the skill system seems pretty pretty awesome actually. Um well, we're going to start rolling back towards base, but uh I'll stop if we see any uh trees or whatnot. You think we'll find John Marston out here? Maybe we can go say hi. Okay, which way to base? I think that's base over there, isn't it? So I guess there is a little bit of a time limit to the game. Like, there, there's an enemy player who's, like, building up too, and, like, is in command of those forces, and we gotta, like, we gotta get bigger and rally everyone and then attack them. Which is kind of cool.
Can you pick a tribe or no? Well, not any based on actual American history. But I suppose the lore about this is that they're trying to make it as uh, generic as possible. So that way you can play as any tribe. Like in your mind. Like you could say that you were the... Uh, you know, the, the Mickey Mouse Club if you wanted. They were very famous. I think camp is over there. Oh, wait a minute. Is that that TP I went to before? With all the medicine? I might need to bring that back. I think I left all that stuff on the ground. Maybe. Yep, I was here. I don't know what stuff looks like when you drop it. I should have put it back in the box then. Oh well. So if we drop stuff, we know it's gone. Not a problem. You've had this in your cart for a while. Thanks for sharing. Oh, you're welcome. I, I, I'm glad you guys are enjoying this one. If you are enjoying the stream, too, by the way, please do sneak your like in before we hit uh, 400 likes. That's awesome, guys. Thank you very much for the support. And if you've always wanted to help the channel grow and you're a subscriber, please do consider becoming a member right now. You can click or tap that join button. Name will pop up on the screen. And uh, you'll get extra perks like your name highlighted in green, a badge next to your name, access to the members-only Discord. And, of course, I think we have one of the best communities on YouTube, really a supportive bunch who's positive and help to share information and, and just hang out. Re really just a very just chill, casual group. And it's just nice to have you all here. So uh, don't be afraid to jump on the Discord and try to play some games with everybody and, and get things together. It's a really lovely place. Okay. Uh, why couldn't I put the bunny back in the box? I didn't have uh, I don't have a rabbit yet. I haven't killed one of those. Seems like a way to... Like, the uh, risk of, like, chasing one of those down and shooting four arrows at it to try to kill it is not worth the meat. It'll probably just be, like, one meat. But I did kill a big old deer earlier. That was pretty cool. All right, let's go to... There's the camp there. So I'm just going to try to gather some more trees and stuff. Sounds like a nice uh, store at the mall. Trees and stuff. You know, it's not next to the... Uh, weenie on a stick in the uh, lemonade place. New subscriber shout out. Darren, thanks for seven. I think we're good here. Yeah, so hickory and flax are like the most required thing in the game. Like I need to start a lumber mill and a plantation. Or a sheep farm. Uh, do you need to craft something to skin an animal like a knife? Uh, you need to skill for it. But I think he carries a knife already that he can use to skin animals. And uh, gather the meat. You just can't use it in combat from what I've seen. But... They are adding spears in the future, and I'm assuming knives and battle axes and other things that were used will definitely be in the game. I see no reason why they couldn't do that. It's pretty easy. They just need to get around to doing it. But they've really crafted a beautiful world to start with. Like, this is gorgeous. And I think a world looking beautiful is just as good and important as it playing nicely as well. So this looks beautiful. This, this is on, the, on par with, like, uh, the Assassin's Creed 3. Wasn't that the one where you could go to revolutionary times? Are there muskets? There's pistols. So there might be muskets. Uh, yeah, you can you can tell your people to go out and gather materials and stuff. So it's it's not just me doing this alone. There's a whole group of us who are out gathering materials. 
And uh, it'd be a good multiplayer game. I'd love to send Pinto out on some quests like, uh, hey, take out the trash and uh, don't forget to clean up your room. Eddie, thanks for subbing. Appreciate that. Actually, we're very close to our uh, members' goal, too, by the way. 13 out of 15, so thanks to everybody who helped us grow tonight. Appreciate it. Flintlocks, pistols, shot uh, shotguns. Cool. That's that's impressive to see. All right, there we go. All right, there's one more tree here, and then we'll head back to base and see if we can finally get our Native American crew, the grilled cheese gang, setting up some cool stuff. Is there a way you can... Um, is there a way you can tell him how to get off the horse? Like, if I want him to get off on the left side, for example, is there a way? He seems to always just get off on the on the left, or the right. Yeah, apparently there's traps coming. There's a lot of skills for things like that, but we're very early in the game. But things will change. Again, these early access type games, remember, things could change at any time, and they could announce anything any day that could really change your opinion of it, so... Good or bad. Okay, let's drop some stuff off at camp. Well, I found 22 wood. I hope our boys found a lot of good stuff, too. I can craft... If I find one more flax, I think I can get two ropes. Uh, let's see. Camp. Settle. Yes. We need 20 wood. And 10 rope. And send. Yay! Alright, so now we can finally start making multiple camps. Finally. <clears throat> Alright, I need some more flax, don't I? Oh, hold Alt to select multiple amounts? Okay. Okay, so we got our first camp being settled. Now if I just drop off a few more things. We can drop off more rope. Okay, so if we get two more rope, we get 20, and that should allow me to make the remaining camps. So we need one more flax plus five. So we need to find six more flax, and then we can finish all of our camps, and we're done. So let's go find some flax. Be able to, yeah, be cool to mount your horse from behind, or like jump down from like a rock onto your horse, or something like that. Like if you climb a tree or something, and then you slide down and just jump on the horse from there, that'd be super cool. Roland G is a little raptor. Thank you very much, Roland. Welcome back. Thank you very much for clicking and tapping that join button. Let's get some, uh... Oh, I don't know. Welcome. Let's get some... What haven't we had in a while? Let's get some KFC. There's no chickens in the game, so let's get some chicken. Alright, so we need to grab... What was it again? Six flax? Or no, I need to make... Yeah, I need six flax in order to make the ropes that I need. I haven't seen it rain in the game yet. I'm sure. Oh, there's some beautiful fog in the game, though. That is that is that is impressive. The fog looks good. Certainly, the parts of a of an interesting, fun game are here. All right, let's jump across to the other side. This is where Arby's started with all fresh roast beef. Yeah, maybe so. They started with boar meat and then worked their way up. Ooh, look at this. It's all foggy. This really feels like weather effects. Like, it feels like it could rain or that it's very cold. Here's what we want here. Some delicious uh, fibers.
Goudance. There's some more flax there. So I guess if you want to get off your horse quickly, you can just uh, make sure you're on the right side. Whatever you want to grab is on the right side. The horse really work, uh, really maneuvers nicely. Not too glitchy. It doesn't doesn't feel weird. Is the game meeting my expectations. I mean, I don't. I didn't really have any expectations, so I guess I'd say yeah. It's an incomplete game, and these open world games are a lot about uh, you know gathering materials and staying alive. So that's pretty cool. And the fact that like the game is all about growing your territory by building camps and recruiting more people and and like building your own Native American tribe and then trying to attack the uh, people who are trying to attack you before they attack and uh, having a big battle. Kind of cool. Uh, Toby, you can find the schedule for that down below in the description. Alright, how much flax do I have now? Twelve? I don't know if that's enough, but, I mean, I guess you could never have enough flax, really. Well, actually, I need to make... I need to make... F Let's see, I needed six, so we just made three? I'll just keep gathering it for a while. New subscriber shout out. James, thanks for subbing. As I've been in this world a little bit longer, I've, I'm definitely um, a little less afraid. Although bears are certainly frightening. And we learned that the hard way. Hi there, Bart. How you doing? Yeah, I could put one worker on flax, but wood is going to be the much more needed material. Do I like trains? I certainly do. Oh, there's some flax up there. Okay, we're getting there. Hmm. Oh dear. <laughs> look at that. Would you look at that horse? Somebody killed this deer. because I was being quiet. Oh look, somebody killed this deer. Eh, hey, you're a doe. I don't want to get the DNR to arrest me. the sound deer makes? Yeah, that's a Homer, Homer Simpson deer. Okay, hopefully we don't stumble upon some bears. Hi there, Idris. Okay, we are looking for a little bit more flax and then we're done here. We can head back to base. We're almost done. Almost done. know how much more we need. Yeah, hey, uh, NPCs will gather for you. You just have to give them commands to do it. Okay, I need six ropes in total. So what do we got in inventory? I think that's everything we needed. Okay, let's head back to base. Wait, what is that? New 
subscriber shout out. Oh, this is that local tribe that I haven't yet encountered. They'll join us as soon as we have three camps, so this will be the first group to talk to once we... That is a much cooler horse. Oh, this one reminds me of like a coffee-flavored jelly bean. Uh, I got 80 points. Does that do anything yet? No, I need I need quite a few points to do it. I think when I complete this objective, I'll get a few points for it. But you mostly get points for hunting and doing some other stuff. It'll it'll take a while, but we'll, we'll get there. Especially by doing some of the main quest stuff that I need to be doing. Now let's go back to base. Where is that? It's marked. Okay, we're RTB. Let's get out of here. Ba -da -ba -ba. Ooh, this is some rocky terrain here. Let's not go that way. wonder, can the horse jump? Let's see. Uh, no, it doesn't seem like he can, but he was able to get through. Okay, let's go. I wish I would have stopped for all that uh, flax, but I think I've had enough of that forever. Sounds beautiful. All right, we're on the road again. New subscriber shout out. David, thank you for subscribing. we go. Oh, he actually did get off the left side of the horse. I guess he defaults to the right unless there's something blocking him. Is that blood? Why is there blood at the camp? Okay. Offload rope and wood. New subscriber shout out. Cool. <clears throat> Alright, let's go ahead and make these remaining camps. Looks like the first one was made, so that's good. Okay, let's make uh, some more camps around here. Let's go there. Send one warrior with... Now, if I hold alt... Ah. How do I know what number that is? Oh, I can fill it in. Ten. What? What is it? Ten ropes? Ten rope. And twenty wood. Okay, and then send one, and let's make another camp. We're almost there. We got one more to do. All right. Wow, the Bobby Ross be praised, and may the lemons be praised as well. We're about to do this. We need uh, ten rope here. Confirm. And 19 wood. Okay, we just need them to build it and then we're done. Then we can request or recruit some other people. Neutral camp can join your resistance. Cool. So now I just got to go and chat with them, I guess. We'll have the neighbors come on over. Hey, come on over. We're just, you know, we're just going to build up an army. Come on over. Okay, let's go visit the neighbors now. You can hit enter to confirm. Enter Sandman. Okay, where is this other camp? Oh, they disappeared. Where'd they go? New subscriber shout out. Rodrigo, thanks for seven. Is my progress being saved? Uh, I don't know. Oh, cool. Like, we built a little camp on the other side. That's awesome. Ah, there's the neighbors. Oh, looks like there's wolves nearby, too. I think I can... Con if I go here, does this confirm? Let's see. So with more 
with more camps, I can recruit more people, and with more people coming, uh, then then I can uh, have them do more tasks. So now that we've done this like backbreaking work of gra get, getting everything by like by hand, we can now tell everybody else to start gathering wood and start making weapons and stuff like that. So that's cool. Let's go over that that away. Is the map always the same? I don't think this is procedurally generated, is it? This looks too beautiful to, to just be randomly spawned. Uh, we need to go this way. So now we can tell all, all of our people, like, we're, we're steps closer to being Big Chief. Chief Boy RD. And then uh, once we do that, we are going to have them take care of all the gathering for us, all the hunting for us. Map is random? So I want to go on a big bear hunt now. After we do this second camp and recruit these guys, let's go on a big bear hunt. Uh, did I mark this? Yep, we're coming up on it now. Oh, there it is. Okay. What's up, bros? Oh, wait. I needed to actually go talk to these other people. They wanted these guys all the way over there. And let's see what this guy says if I just chat with him. What's up, bro? Will you join our camp? We will join your fight. Sweet, bro. Does that mean our territory expanded? I don't, I don't know what that means now. Tame horses or patrol... Or send warriors to other camp. Um, whatever. All right, let's go recruit these guys now. And if we happen to encounter bears on the way, then we will shoot them. And if I need more tents, then I'll just tell everyone to start gathering stuff. Actually, can I tell these guys to gather? Will you guys start gathering stuff? Yeah, we'll do uh, bear bear-handed combat with the bear. Okay, we can't set them to gather, but I can tell them to... Send warriors to tame horses. That's cool. Oh, upgrade camp. Oh. Oh, we saw that before, though. Oh, is there buffalo? Oh, I don't think we can upgrade, because I don't even think buffalo are here. Put items in the camp. Travel to the camp. Ah, eh, you know what? I don't mind. Let's just go to the other camp and get the main objective done, and then we'll come back and fiddle with the, uh, the side quests. And if we happen to find a bear, we will uh, have a physical discussion. I hope to God 18 arrows is enough. The game is lacking a little bit of music, though, but perhaps that's, um... Perhaps that's... better. But it would be nice to have some kind of, like, very faint instrumental going in the background. Maybe just, like, a calm drum every once in a while, just to kind of remind you that you're not dead. Let's see. So we got to go that away. So um, we also need to. I think the bears are probably closest to the river all the time because bears usually like eat salmon and fish, but that doesn't mean they're not elsewhere. Yeah, when I get back to the camp, I'll uh, start managing the camp a little bit more and tell everyone to. Well, what I what I really want to do is. I guess I have some questions like, A, how do I expand my territory? And B, how do I tell all the other camps to, like, go back? Like, we need everybody at a big camp so we can all work together. So, like, how do we tell everyone to, like, pool all of our resources? But I will find that in due time. Oh, it looks like there's actually a camp up here. But I can't get this way. Salmon, yeah. Bears eat like kings.
bum 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 Where's that little camp? Is it over here? Oh, I went right past it. Be this way. Well, I've been over here before, so I don't think there's bears. I do like how the uh, uh, the horse kind of jumps over down trees and stuff. Like you can kind of see a little, yeah, a little jump animation for when it does that. All right, where's the camp? There we go. So these are like little fast travel points. If we stop to light them, we can also save there, so that's helpful. Disband basic camps. The warriors will travel to the nearest camp. Hmm, let's see. So if I disband this camp, they'll go automatically. Will they bring this stuff, though? It seems like there's six bow and arrows and 64 arrows. Will they take those automatically, or do I have to transport them? <laughs> but my main goal right now... Actually, let's let's sneak up on this camp. Apparently there's like a... a bad guy camp in front of us. Let's sneak up on these guys. And then... we'll go to the other camp. Maybe I should have saved. Oop. Interrogation. Killing with the left mouse button is n not an only way to deal with the enemy at close range combat. When you're close enough to an enemy, you can trigger an inter interrogation by pressing F. During the interrogation, you can gain a... Uh, useful information. Note that the camp's group leader knows more than the other members. Interrogation can be resolved by killing or stunning enemies. If the en enemy detected you or is aware of your presence, you can't grab him. Immediately, you must get his health below 16%. Percentages can be increased by learning skills. Oh, I don't... Uh-oh. Now this suddenly got a little bit more complicated than just, like, jumping a dude. How many guys are here? I see a guy over to the right. Let me just scout this place out. I see two guys. One sitting by the fire and the other one... Oh, hell, are they making Campbell's tomato soup? Oh, I might, I might need to swing in there. If that's that low sodium, I'm in. Enemies need some time to find out your presence. The amount of time needed... Uh, avoid inappropriate. You can hide in the nearest foliage or sneak hold C. Well, this isn't really sneaking. This is just like... Does that guy have a shotgun or something? Oh, is he actually coming over here, though? Uh-oh. I think he's just on a standard patrol. Well, I thought I saw me a mediocre YouTuber, but I must have been mistaken. Daygum. Larry, is that chili ready yet? It is scrumptious, I must say. All right, well, let's leave. We'll come back later. It looks like there's only two guys here. What does information give me? Like if, if I interrogate a guy, what, what do I do with that? Cynthia, thanks for seven. Okay, let's uh, find the horsey horse. Where'd the horse go?
Oh, they can detect me that far out? Damn. I almost got spotted, but I was way far away. All right, well, we know well, it's almost nighttime now. We could probably come back, but let's let's go back to this camp. We'll come back later. Intimidating increases your reputation? Okay. But what does, like, intimidation do and what does, like, knowledge do? Or, like, interrogation? Because didn't it say I could interrogate? Saying that the camp leader knows more than the regular guys? I, I guess we'll, we'll, we'll have to figure that out as we go on. Enemy AI is pretty good? Okay. We'll have to be... We'll have to attack at night then when they're sleeping and see if we can knock them both out and ask them some questions. Like if they're interested in saving 15% uh, or more on their car insurance. Roy Brandon has become a member! Thank you very much for clicking and tapping that join button. You are awesome. There seems to be a fort of death to our right, so let's not go there. Let's go up this way. Uh, where's that camp? Oh, there it is. Good. First objective finally complete. What's up, bro? Will you join our camp? We feel a great spirit coming from you. We will join your fight. Sweet. Let's, uh... Well, don't get all pushy, sir. I just invited you to our, to our cool club. Our, our tree fort. We got a cool tree fort. And mom's making pizza rolls. Come on, you guys should join. Let's go. Come on, do something. This is like you guys when you tell me to play a game. Come on. All right, we have accomplished our goal tonight of 15 new members, so thank you guys for clicking and tapping that join button. That is awesome. Thank you, thank you. Spirit Quest? I don't I don't know. Spirit Quest sounds like a Disney movie. Okay, so now we've finished that. Objectives, yeah, I know about those already. So now we can do... Wow, we get 1,000 SP if we kill somebody named Kyle er Errol or something. We get 3,000 if we do... Kill and intimidate camp recovery. Location unknown. Oh, so we got... Oh, I see now. So we can find camp recovery by intimidating these other smaller camps. Ah, okay. All right, let's do some uh, tribe management now. So if I click disband, do all these items go back to my main camp? Warriors from this camp will move to the nearest camp, which they won't be able to pick up which they won't be able... Wait. Items which they won't be able to pick up will be lost. So how do I know if they'll grab this stuff? Can I assign them to carry this stuff? How big is the map? Well, it seems pretty huge. Like, I've only really... This whole time, we've been only being in these areas. And the map is, like... Like, huge. Like, there's even more to the south that I can't even see. So it seems like it's a gargantuan map really big. Okay, so warriors can carry 15. Okay, so we should be fine. So let's disband this camp. Yes. And then where do they go? And if I disband this camp... So then they, they're all going here then, because this is the nearest camp, right? So everybody's like spread out across the... So everyone's spread out across the map. We have to do quests to make them think that we're cool. And then when we scam them... <laughs> and tell them, hey, come on over to our place. We're really cool. When they find out we're not that cool, they got it. What's this game about? I think about like 10 or 20 bucks. Oh, there they go. So they're going to the camp and they're carrying all the stuff. Sweet. Excellent. So now we get a lot more... So now we can tell these individual camps to start doing stuff, right? Like, settle... Or no, like, we can we can tell them to keep gathering stuff. Oh, yeah, okay, so they're gathering more wood, and then we can make more camps. Sweet. <laughs> so now all I gotta do is go around and find more camps, don't I? It's nighttime. Should we go raid those dudes? 
All right, if we get to 500 likes, I'll go raid that other enemy camp. So if you guys want to see me knock some fools out, let's let's get her up there. We'll take a little jaunt over there and see if we can drum up the support. We got to do it. Let's see which way are we going. Okay, we'll we'll park here. We'll park the car over here. Oh, I hope our guys don't like literally walk through their camp. Are these guys going to get caught? All right, if you want if you want me to sneak up on dudes, let's see how it goes. Yeah, we're kind of fighting for control of the map. Like we want to we want to recruit all the other like independent tribes to our tribe and then we want to like battle out the battle out the big enemy. Cuz like at the top of the map here, you can see I control 4.1% of the map and the enemy controls 5.1% of the map. <laughs> But now that I've got a camp started, now I can now I can go around and start recruiting others and then expanding our territory. But I don't know how to do that yet. But I will I will I will find I will find it out soon enough. And then there's other objectives and stuff too. Okay, I think we're gonna park here. Shh. Okay, let's sneak up on them. Okay, so we gotta go this way. New subscriber shout out. Welcome to all of you new subs and all you new members too. Thank you, buddy, for all the super chats tonight and all the all the love. This game is so cool. Do we have night vision goggles or anything? I wonder if I can snipe. Okay, where's this camp now? Right over there. Okay, you guys remember remember we parked our horse next to a tree in a rock. Can you guys remember that? Hickory. I wonder if these guys put their fire out at night. Yeah, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sneak up on these guys and then show them my YouTube channel and they'll, boom, they'll be just put right to sleep right there. The moment I show them one of my videos, boom, they're out. They're out. And it's like a permanent sleep too, like Cinderella or Sleeping Beauty. Where, uh, you know, it takes a kiss from James Charles to wake him up. Here we go. Do I think I can throw rocks? I don't think I can pick rocks up. Apparently they're very rocks are very rare in this in this world. Okay, there's the camp. Is that a bear sleeping in their camp? What is that? Okay, very, very quiet chat. Now, we don't want to kill these guys. We want to, like, intimidate them and, like, tie them up or something or beat them up, sneak up on them. They're just blacked out by the fire? Okay. These guys are really close to each other. If I grab one, is it going to trigger the other one? I think the guy in the red shirt looks like he's a little bit more the boss man, because he was out there cooking the soup earlier. You guys know how it is. Wait, I thought this guy was wearing red. Loot the tent first? Okay. Oh, 
Oh, dude. Oh, they got a gun. Dude. Oh, weapon blueprints? What's all this stuff? Oh, dude. Iron arrows. Oh, I want all this stuff. Okay. Don't make loot. Don't loot. It makes noise. These guys are out like a light. Okay, let's give one of these guys a hug. I can tell everything you want. You're probably looking for this. Go check it. I think Please the other guy woke up. Alone. You can intimidate stunned enemies by holding F. Uh, oh, I can loot him too? Oh, yes, indeed I can. I got myself a rifle. Woo! Okay, let's uh, intimidate. What am I doing? What the? What the hell? <laughs> what, are you, what are you doing, dude? Stop it. <laughs> you don't have your gun. Here, I'm going to mess with your buddy now. Please don't kill me. Wait, wait, here's my belongings. There's nothing else to say. <laughs> oh, magic powder that causes hallucinations? Oh, that is... Oh, boy. That is some really great looking soup. Wow. That is the most uh, detailed soup I think I've ever seen in a game. Oh, yeah, let's go to the campfire. Add gunpowder. Campfire explodes when it lights on? Oh, dude, you can sabotage their campfire by, like, putting gunpowder all around it. That's awesome. All right, sir. Uh, Well, let's loot first. Yeah, I'll take your pistol. All your ammo. This guy is definitely a hothead. All right, hold F to intimidate. All right, here we go. Sprinkle a little crack on him. There we go. There we go for the cops. Oh, yeah. They're never going to believe his story. What is that question mark in there? Okay, so we sprinkled some crack on some guys, and we're out of here. There were three beds, though. Why? Oh, dear. Oh, this must be the leader. He's asleep, too. All right, this is, uh, this is a bore. Let's go back to the uh, camp. Oh, wait, the horse. Um, so that's weird. Oh, somebody's missing? Is that a glitch? I mean, I, t I interrogated the two guys. That was hilarious. Oh, and now we have a big old gun. Let's, let's, let's get our rifle out. Oh, dude, this is so cool. Can I, how do I pull out the rifle? That's right. Let's, re let's reload that. Oh, yeah, now I got my nine. Empty the loot bag to clear the camp? I think I did, didn't I? Let me see. That one's empty. Is there more loot in the camp? It said it was cleared, though. It said it disappeared. And it's, uh... Yeah, now we're strapped with gats, yo. Now I'm ready to roll up on a homie. And really wet up a hater. Can I loot these things? Are these like... Oh, they're just little pads? Okay. Should be two bags? Well, they're both empty. 
And the camp is marked as an X. Maybe it's glitched out. I don't know. I didn't I didn't learn anything from those guys. There's just like a boar and whatever else. Alright, let's get the horse and head back home. See if we can find some more camps. Well, now we got ourselves a gun. Actually, several guns. I got some pistols now and some rifles. And they're never going to believe those guys because I sprinkled some crack on them and that won't hold up in court. Uh, the YouTuber snuck up on me when I was sleeping and he he stood me up and then punched me in my face. Uh, Mr. Douglas, the police found you with crack sprinkled on you. Alright, I think our horsey is over here somewhere. Okay, well that was pretty cool. I really enjoyed that, like, stealth. That wasn't, uh... It needs a little work, but it wasn't, like, the worst stealth I've ever played. That was that was definitely nice. Okay. Yeah, I can equip my tribe. So this is kind of like... Uh, do you remember when we played uh, Guerrilla Warfare? It's kind of like that game, except instead of doing an overworld map, you're actually in the map. So we can, uh... You know, we can we can equip our shooters uh, to wet up the homies, etc., etc. Well, there's a fort over there. Yeah, we're not going anywhere near that. That's actually a military fort. But we could probably attack eventually. Yeah, we do have a tribe. Uh, it's called the Grilled Cheese Gang. And uh, we pay homage to Kraft Singles. Okay, let's head home instead of towards the camp. Um, I think I'll try to go this way and see what we might encounter on the halfway point. Craft a scope? I don't have enough points yet. I have 300 skill points. I don't think I have enough for that. Nope, we need 510. But at least I got points for knocking out some people, so now I know how easy it is to sneak up on camps. I should just do it at night while they're sleeping. That's fine. So now if we find a bear, I can shoot it in the face. Oh, giving our people is not weapons is not good unless you give them repeater rifles? Okay. Well, then we will do just that. All right, let's take the road. I hope there's no traffic. You've seen Revenant? Yeah. I'm getting some Revenant vibes from this, for sure. Okay, there's wolves up ahead. Oh, there's a trading post. Unfortunately, I don't have any of my stuff with me, though, so I can't really trade. But let's go take a look at it and see how it looks. All right, this game is... Mm. Now, apparently, the developers are looking for voice actors, so if you want somebody to... I'll, I'll do all the narration. No problem. Would be This game would be good with an opening cutscene to show, like, a beautiful, like, mountain valley and all the trees and stuff. And, uh, to set up the story. That'd be cool. Oh. Now, is a trade post, uh, friendly? Like, can I... It, it's yellow on the map, so I'm assuming I can kind of just walk up. And this guy will be cool. I think he's taking a leak behind his tent. Alright, I better sneak up on a good sale. Can I knock this guy out and, like, take his stuff, like the traitor in Resident Evil 4? Let's use stealth, but make him see us. Let's be the world's worst stealth guy now. <laughs> He's staring right at me. What's up, bro? I don't want to loot. I'd rather trade for fair. Are you looking for a barter? Yes. Okay, so what has he got? Lock bolt screws, canteens... Glue. A Russell M1868. What was that? Uh, looks like a... Oh, that's a... Nice revolver. Nothing really good here, but oh well. 
Uh, we've got... So I think the Cole 1848 is probably good, and also the Russell M18, but it seems like it's just a single-shot rifle, so... Sell the medicine? Yeah, but I don't think he has anything I want at the moment, though. I don't want to loot him either. Maybe we can come back and steal later. Is that a bear? Do 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 do. Where'd the horse go? We'll come back and trade with them later. Do trade deals upgrade? Or, uh, uh, like if I come back in a few days or if I reload the game or something, does he have different items? How does that work? Okay, so there's wolves around here. Oh, there's a. Oh, there's actually a friendly camp nearby. Let's go to the friendly camp there. And then. Also, we were told to stop. If we can stop these guys from getting wood, it'll slow them down from building houses and stuff. I'm going to have sleeping bears in my tent now. Oh, we got people at our, our camp. Yeah, we're essentially becoming like a tribal leader. So it's kind of cool. You started as just some random dude who got like kidnapped on a train. And then a bunch of people rescued you. And now you've got... Um, now you got to start your own tribe to like fight back. Kind of neat. So let's do... Okay, so let's go to this camp and see if we can recruit them. And then maybe sneak over to the enemy camp. Maybe the, the, well, it'll have to be nighttime, but by the time I get over there. Oh. The hell was that? Oh, we got wolves. Oh boy. If we get over to the friendly camp, we should be fine. Uh, is there a way to heal the horse, or does the horse not take damage? Because it seems like only I'm damaged. There you go. You two can chat about horsey things. I'll be back. Alright, let's see. Hello, sir. Uh, will you join our fight? We feel a great spirit. Cool, thanks. We get recruited another, another set of homies. Uh, you were actually the guy who rescued the other one on the prison train. Oh, really? Okay, they kind of make the story a little hard to understand then. Okay, these guys are going to head to our new camp now. Is there a possibility that these guys will be killed on their way to the camp? Like, I just don't want to lose these guys because, like, you know, they their AI pathing took them through, like, literally a fort or something. Okay, so, what's my XP at? 300? Darn. It's not enough to get the spy glass. I wanted to, like, spy out the, uh, the logging camp or something like that. Greeting from the Netherlands? Say hey there, how are you? We are the chief of the resistance? I thought we had to, like, become the chief. You know, like, Chef Boyardee wasn't born a chef. He was, like, he had to become one with the chef. Mo you know, he had to be born by it, molded by it. Oh, look, guys. giant rock. Can we see the logging camp from here? Wow, this is cool. I guess we gotta go down. I think you can rename the tribe. Oh, can I? Wait, why is it one out of four? <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Can I rename the landscape? I didn't know I could do that. You also need to loot fallen warriors to get their bows and ammo. Uh-oh. That means that you had a part one to that message that probably said they'll die. Uh-oh. Uh, 
Okay, let's... I think we'll park the car over here. If I can... Well, this all looks like a giant cliff. I don't know if I can get down from here. We better put her in low gear here. There we go. 4x4 four four drive. There we go. Playing spin tires all of a sudden. Idiot. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Touched, touched the tree and then it, it dropped, so it thought it took fall damage. Well, let's not too get, get too close here with the horse. How far away is this place? Oh, it's on the other side of the rock. back up there, actually. Alright, horsey, you wait here. And I'll jump down and escape on the horse from here. Alright, stay there, girl. Why do I hear bugs? Is there like a corpse around or something? Hi there, District 7. How you doing? Welcome aboard, everybody. Good to see you all here. Thanks for dropping off your likes. Almost a f the big 500, so thanks for smashing like on the video. If you haven't subscribed, too, make sure you do that. I think we want to play this again tomorrow. I think there's a lot of game here, even though it's unfinished for us to get through, and I think this is really fun, so we're going to continue this one. I just need to find the camp. Bees? It could be bees. Maybe there's honey in the game. Honey, I shrunk the kids. Alright, I better take out a different weapon just in case. There we go. Or I just need a shower? Maybe. Alright, this is the McGilvray Forest something area. Austin, thanks for subbing. You know what? I'm actually really full on items. So if I loot anything from here, I'm probably not going to be able to carry it back to the horse. But we could at least scout this area out and see who's here. So we know... how many people are here on patrol. And it's almost night time. Looks like two guys cutting down a big tree. Should we wait till they go to bed and then rob them? Intimidate them? Well, let's wait till they go to bed. My warriors can loot for me? Oh, that's cool. So we can tell them to come down here and pick up a bunch of stuff. Alright, they're both chatting about how bad my videos are. Chat, keep things to English now. I see some Dutchies here, but remember, we all need to communicate. So English, if you, if you please. Can I snipe them with the rifle? I can, but I get more... It's better to actually uh, sneak up and rob them. You get more... Uh, skill points by doing it the hard way, which makes sense. Okay, they're going back to cooking their old soup. You need to tell them uh, to attack. If there's no enemy, they'll loot. Oh, cool. All right, well, let's knock these guys out and then call over the homies. Where's this second guy?
And we'll wait till they fall asleep. Will they sleep? I don't see any beds. Oh, I'm so jealous. They're having beef stew and they didn't invite me. I might have to get the gun out. Oh, there they go. They're laying down. Okay. If they're laying down, are they asleep right away? Or are they, like, talking about, like, paste picante sauce? New York City! Here we go. We're going to very quietly punch this guy loudly in the face. Ready? All right. Paste picante. I can be useful. I know where's what are you looking for? Clay Grove is in search of gold. With gold, the Clay Vorv can expand their territory. Please leave me alone. Sir, I knocked out the... Don't you do it! Oh! He's trying to, trying to wet me up. Dude, don't you do it. Well, that worked the first time. He's got an arrow right through his chest. Sir? Oh, you can't be more stealthy than me. I'm stealth. You can't out-stealth me. I see you there. Hi. <laughs> Are you gonna... Well, I've kind of already interrogated... Gated. I kind of want to interrogate again. Don't I get more points for that? Dascrit. Can I like sneak up behind him? Eh, whatever. Ooh, he had melons and tomatoes on him. Oh, and he had that high qu that pistol I wanted. Oh, I can't carry any more. Oh, too much for the horse. Of course, of course. Meh. Okay, I don't know why he woke up though. Because the last time I knocked somebody out, <laughs> there it was very quiet. But okay. Oh, what's up, Owl? How you doing? I guess we'll just take all the guns and stuff. All right, let's do a little intimidation. Sprinkle a little crack on them for the police. Do 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 do. Sprinkle a little crack. Do 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 do. Hey. He tried to go for his gun. What happened? I sprinkled crack on him. Okay, whatever. The camp is gone. And at least I got some more information, so that's good. So there's an example of how to do it and how not to do it. Bader says you're overweight? How dare you? I'm festively plump. This is you, You're just jealous of this sexy gamer body. Let's have some more lunch. Let's take a little bit of... 
Uh, I guess we'll eat some medicine, too. Have an aspirin. There we go. Okay. How am I? Oh, I'm pretty good. This stealth section didn't go the way I was hoping. Is that an axe? Oh, I can't pick it up, though. I like how you can s sabotage the, uh, the campfire, though, and, like, have it explode if they light it up. That's cool. All right, let's do a little bit more looting. Uh, let's see. Wood and rope. We don't need that stuff. Shovel seems useful. Glass. Bunch of ammo seems good. Gunpowder seems good. Wait, I had an experimental optical scope? Where is that? Ooh. I, now I got a long-range scope. Okay, now we can start uh, popping fools from a long distance. That is cool. Uh, this game is called This Land is My Land. And this is... That was pretty good. I think... I feel like that went bad the second time. I, I feel like it glitched out. Because both guys went to sleep. New subscriber shout out. I grabbed one of them, but the grab animation is just basically punching somebody in the face. So I think it woke up the other dude, except it didn't wake him up the previous time. Like, when we raided the first camp, it totally... It, w it went perfect. But the second time... I... Even, even when I... Uh, even when I, like, sprinkled some dust or whatever on that, that second guy, he, like, woke up and then punched me in the face, then started tripping out, but then came over it and then tried to go for his gun, so I shot him. New I don't subscriber know. Shout out. Uh, let's see. The, the scope is a part of gun craft. Oh, I can, like, craft a scope? Hmm. All right, well, now we got to walk back to the horse, and this is a problem because now I'm 22 pounds overweight. And I don't know what I'm going to drop. I guess we could walk to the trader from here on foot and trade for something else. Oh, that's great. Oh well. Anyway, that was funny. So our first raid went pretty well. The second one was like, meh. Like, I didn't die. Both guys, like, the camp is gone. You know, whatever. But now we got to. Now the guy's looking for gold, so now we got to go do that. All uh, right, where's the horse? Oh man, I wish. Is there a way to carry more stuff? Uh, when you stun, they are stunned for only ten seconds or to five minutes, and they get kicked away by another NPC. Yeah, but when I grabbed the first guy, he didn't like. I figured they were both asleep. So, like, how do you? If there's a group of like four people sleeping, how are you supposed to like, you know, deal with that situation stealthily? Because it seems like once you go for the first person, you immediately uh, wake up everybody. Kind of weird. Like the, the moment you grab somebody is the moment everybody becomes awake. All right, the horse is over here. All right, how, what do I get rid of? I guess I could go trade a lot of these guns, huh? For a better gun, maybe? What's the heaviest thing we have? Wow, some of these small pistols weigh like three pounds very carefully, but that doesn't like really explain how to do it. Like, It's like, oh, how do I stealthily take that guy out? Very stealthily. It's like, oh, ah, uh, what? As soon as you grab stun, then go on to the next one? Okay. That's fair enough. But it seems like the guy woke up immediately. But regardless, it's an early access game, so no matter what I do, it, the, the whole stealth system could change next time. Maybe there'll be like a knockout arrow. Wait, isn't there, isn't there a stun arrow that you can make from rocks? All right, horsey. I guess I should have had those guys come in like... Oh, cool. There's like a circle drawn around its eye. Cool. I guess I could have had my warriors come and loot, couldn't I? Is there a way I can have workers come out and like drop them off stuff? Like, is there a way I can exchange inventories? Oh, looks like we have a lot of balls. Okay, well, I guess I don't need... Rope, rope is kind of hard to get. And same with the gunpowder. seems pretty rare, too. There's wooden arrows and iron arrows. Those seem useful. Oh, I, don't, I really don't want to get rid of anything. I want to just go trade, but it's going to be a long walk. The old trading site. 
Okay, let's do this. If I go back to the camp and put stuff in the storage box, I can I can make two trips, right? Oh, really? Your weight will affect your stealth. That's interesting. Okay. All right, well, I'm going to go up to the top of the camp, then drop off some of my loot, and then uh, I'm going to just take two trips to the trading post. That should be pretty cool. Drop the balls and the low-level guns. They aren't any good. Yeah. Maybe. It's it's better than trading uh, flax and wood that I have so far. So I don't want to, like, do it yet. Okay, so now our next goal is to uh, prevent the Claygrove group from expanding. So we need to kill and intimidate everyone at the Clay Gr Claygrove gold gatherer's mine. So now we got to go raid a gold mine. Well, that's interesting. Can you get a mule? I guess I'm the mule right now. But I just, I think I'll leave some of it and uh, put some in the, put some stuff in the box and make two trips. So right now it's like Death Stranding except without the backpack. I wonder if, if I go to the gold, if I go to the gold mine, is there like a possibility that I could, uh, like steal gold or something like that? Like is there going to be gold nuggets or gold bars or something waiting for me? That could be so cool. Guns are useless. Um, I like the rifle that I have for anti-bear protection. That's good. Alright, so there should be a storage box up here. Once I can run again, then it'll, things will speed up. But I got a little carried away of getting a bunch of stuff and not being able to, like, trade for it. But what, I'll, what I'll try to do is trade all the uh, handguns for, like, rifles or something. Also, can I only trade, or is there not, like... Can I, like, get go money? Can I trade stuff for money? I really like this handgun, too. Oh, there we go. Oh, that took out all the weight. Look at that. 15 pounds for the long rifle. Get better bows. Yeah, I'll have to get materials for that, won't I? So that, requ that requires a few things. Yeah, I'd rather take somebody out stealthily from across the map with one bow shot than, like, a loud rifle. Like, it's it's like the 1800s. There ain't no such thing as a suppressor or a silencer or any of that. Oh. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have gone so hastily. Oh, well. Uh, where's the Mr. Horse? I can hear you, sir. Where are you? There you are. Trading tokens, but you have to go online for the social? Trading tokens? What the? What about U.S. dollars? Dude, this is America. Shout out. Uh, Arcan, thank you for subbing. Keep an eye out on my karma. Yeah, I killed two dudes already, but luckily, that was uh, kind of like a la That's not how I intend to do things. That's kind of more of like a last-ditch effort. Okay. So if I go to the trader right now and trade a bunch of stuff, can I, I can turn that in for funsies points? It's all low quality stuff, so it's probably worth a trade. Let's get the, uh, let's take everything but one of the rifles. I think I'm already, yep, already over the limit. Uh, well, the wooden bow is six? Oh, I can just make one of those later. Let's leave the bow, the bow here. Bow jangles will leave. And let's leave shovels here. Oh, they're only point two zero. Mm, I guess we'll have to leave one of the guns. All right, we'll come back. All right, everyone, remember we've got stuff at the uh, at the mill, at the uh, sawmill slash yumber, lump, the yumber lard. At the old Yumberlard. 
Okay. Yeah, we're expanding the borders of Rap ancient Raptoria. It's uh, 1996, and we don't have the internet yet. This is what times were like, kids, before uh, all that was implemented. Well, U.S. dollars could still be a currency in the game. Besides, there hasn't been anything really to show that this is a game that takes place in the American West, even though it totally does. But it's not like it had said anything outright honestly about it. Okay, let's trade. Oh, the the turnover pistol? Or the... Oh. What is this stuff? How, how do I get tokens for this stuff? Hmm. Let's see. And maybe we just better bring all this stuff back to camp. Alright. Because I don't think he has anything I want. Let's just bring stuff back to camp and... Once I have better items, I'll figure out what to do. Alright, let's go to uh, base camp. And then we'll have to remember that the... MacGyver logging camp is where all of our stuff is. Well, let's go back to camp and give some orders. It's been, it's been a while so, since we've gone home. Let's go, let's go home. Do, 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 do. This is the type of game, like in Skyrim, where it's like, sometimes it's better to fast travel, but the fact that you can just walk across the map... Or, uh, take your horse is pretty cool. Like, why fast travel when you can just kind of... Kind of beautiful to look at. Oh. Oh, we certainly get a lot, lot louder on the roads. Alright, kids, if we see a bear, we gotta take it down as revenge. cool if there was like a little quick time event where if a bear grabbed you, you could like stab it or something like that. Uh, don't we have to cross the river soon? Oh yeah, up here. You'll let me know if you see a bear? Awesome. Thank you. We've barely seen any. got to go through the woods and then over the river to base camp we go uh, I think it's right here left left to cross the river there we go ah this is cool I'm glad we're actually next to the the river all right, boys, I brought guns. Everybody gather around. I'll show you how to use it. Wow, we got lots of bows. Good job, everybody. Nice job. Wow. We have, like, a nuclear stockpile here. The UN's going to show up and have a field day with this. Let's just drop everything. Start from zero. All right, good. Yeah, the bears seem like they're going to be near the river or something like that. That certainly seems how we found it so far. All right, let's take a look at the map again. 
All right, we got a lot more to do. I want to go uh, find a gold camp now. So where did it say the gold camp was? Did it mark it? <laughs> Objectives. Uh, expansion prevention. 1,200 plus karma. I don't think I can mark it on the map, can I? It doesn't say where it is. Oh, unless I have to find Clay Grove on the map. Is that a thing? Oh, there it is. Wait, Camp Recovery? Oh, might have imprisoned warriors. Oh, that's probably like a fort. I don't know about that. Must be on the map somewhere. <clears throat> we'll have to find it. All right, so goals are to uh, eliminate camp recovery leader for 3,000 SP. Prevent Clay Grove from expanding. Find somebody who's trying to kill us. And then also find the old camp and take over leftover items for 150. I guess I skipped that quest because it was just super easy. Get the tribe ready to break out our buddies. Yeah, that's going to be one of the main goals. All right, let's see here. Uh, let's go over Meow. Okay, we're resting and saving. Good. All right, guys, if you haven't already, make sure you dump off all your likes and subscribe if you're new here. I want to pick this one up again uh, tomorrow. We'll get healed up and uh, maybe continue going out on some quests. There's actually quite a bit to do here, and it's quite a fun game. So if you'd like to see me come back tomorrow, make sure you change the notification bell to all. If you do not click or tap the notification bell and do not click or tap all, you will guaranteed miss out on live streams and videos. We hear it all the time, every stream. People are talking about how they didn't get notifications, didn't see the video. So make sure you do that so you can see more of this game. It's lots of fun. This Land is My Land is available now on Steam. And I think I'm going to try it again tomorrow and do a little bit more. Day after that, me and Pindor are going to play Tropico 6 with some new DLC. And if you guys want to see what I'm doing next on the channel, check the description down below. And you can see all the videos that I'm doing uh, down below in the description. You guys have been great. Thanks for the support, the tips. This has been really fun. I like this game, and it's very promising for the future. I hope you all enjoy your afternoon, good evening, and good night. And I will see you all tomorrow for more. Thanks for being here, and I will see you all tomorrow. Say goodbye, everybody. We'll see you soon. Goodbye, everyone. Good night. Take care. We'll see you next time.